Hi, friends. Lucas, hello. Hi, Erin. Hey, Grace. Hey, Char Girl. Tracy, hello, hello. Daniel, Jaden. Oh my gosh, yes, we're prepping today, guys. Are we so excited? <laughs> Hello, Ellie, Jessica, Danielle. Uh-oh. Sorry if y'all hear that echo. My computer was on. <laughs> Jamie, Jaden. Hey, Steph. Hi, Libby and Mimi. Oh, my God. So excited to see you guys. Tracy, I love your channel best ever. Thank you so much. I'm so glad you're here. Danielle, you started over, woke up at 2 a.m. to play, and your controller was acting weird, and you hit new game and pushed. Yes, you're starting over. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Hi, you guys. Oh, I'm so excited to get into it today. All settled and ready to play along tonight? Perfect, Libby. Now, y'all don't be mad at me. I have not prepared at all. Maybe, hello. Welcome in. Chantel, we're playing together. I love that. Molly, you just saw the scar. I, call, I said Maylee. Molly, you saw the scar update? Nice. I know. I'm so excited. Grace, you got Elsa's dress? Yes. I think we're going to get Elsa's dress. Yes, they got it Friday. Is everybody excited for the weekend? What are our weekend plans? I actually inspired you to give this game a second chance and it stole my heart. Jaden, I'm so happy to hear that. Were you thrown off at the beginning? It wasn't really your fave. Okay, first things first. Guys, y'all already know. Let's kick it off. We got to get up to... What? Oh, nobody's home. We got to get up here to Kristoff's house because we need that shard that's in there. <laughs> I think it's in here. Because that man Kristoff was asleep. There it is. There it is. There it is. Okay, so let's see. Oh, oh, there's Elsa. She just popped up right behind us. Okay, so we're looking for the last crest. It's a crest. Let me see. Where is it? Staying inside, supposed to rain this weekend. Ooh, perfect weekend to play some Dreamlight Valley or Coral Island. Where would this crest be? Let's take a look around. Look in the clock. Oh, that's right. There was a hint that it was in the clock. Ah, there it is. We got the last one. Oh my God, this means, y'all know what this means. Grace, we're about to get that Elsa dress too. It was showing snow today where you live. Ellie, snow? Okay, snow. By the way, guys, if you haven't already, don't forget to hit the like button on the stream so we can get some more friends in here tonight as we prepare for Scar. Uh-oh. Let's water these Let's water these onions, y'all. I haven't planted pumpkins. I have done no prep. I feel like I'm in shambles right now. I'm not even going to lie to you guys. I'm not even going to lie. We're both light ice ladies. You know it. I'm so excited though because I feel like the wings, the other wings that we have, it's gonna look really good with this with her dress. At least we're gonna kick it off with that. Okay, so some other things too. Let's just talk about what the goals are today, my friends. Okay. So we need to get everybody else to level close to level 10. Obviously, we won't be get up, be able to get Prince Eric there, but we can work on Anna and Goof or Donald Duck. Maybe Mickey and Minnie if they're not asleep. But we're going to be working on a lot of friendship. And then we have a couple of quests to work out. But we've pretty much done a lot. So we're, I think, almost ready for Scar. But I have no idea what to expect with Scar. So I am just, oh, I don't know. I don't know, y'all. What do we expect? The little um, video that they released, the thumbnail, it's like a thumbnail video, looks so good. Did y'all see the little cave in the background? Look at Ariel with her little legs walking around. Girl, I don't trust Scar either. I don't trust it either. He's going to be up to some malicious shit, y'all. I already know. He's going to wreak havoc on the valley that we've just worked so hard. Oh, 
I'm running the wrong direction and I'm running really slow, so let's eat. I am all organized, Grace, so you will be happy to know that my inventory is organized. <laughs> Libby the dev say he'll bring chaos. Oh my. Not chaos to a valley that we've worked to keep so peaceful. Yeah, we need to pick up all of these wood and sticks because y'all know many got a big clock or whatever it is that we need to build for her. <laughs> oh my gosh, let's place this last crest. Theodora, good morning to ya. <laughs> hey, welcome in. Oh my gosh, y'all ready for this? Dun -dun 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 <laughs> Okay, we've got all of them. Y'all know me, I gotta take a pic. It didn't happen unless I have a picture. We look beautiful in here with this little icy glow. There we go, that's a good one. I love this outfit that we have on. Y'all still loving the Ursula dress? Better not hoard again, I'll be <laughs> raging. <laughs> Not like the lava monster. Oh no. Oh no. You know, I could really go for the dress that Elsa has on right now, though. All right, let's talk to Elsa. I remember it all now. I wanted to keep something safe. Something the forgetting was threatening. Anna helped me hide the crest, but then I realized anyone could stumble upon them, so I went to Merlin, and he made sure that they would only reappear if someone wielding dreamlike magic was near. Mmm. Well, now that we put the crest back in their rightful places, we need to put the right items on the glowing pedestals. Mm. The forgetting was so disturbing that I wanted to be sure what I held dear was safe. Um, I would have done the same. Not my solution would have been way simpler. <laughs> That's good mm -hmm. to hear. Now, Merlin created magic links to both Dreamlight Valley and Arendelle. I helped him pick up the items to use. TJ, hello! Hello, hello. A plate of Aridelian pickled herring for the food I brought to the village. A passion white lily to represent ice and snow. A carrot, since they're rather special to some of my dear friends. And a gold igot for the bond Anna and I have to our royal heritage. If we place one of each on the pedestals, we'll find what I hit. That was fun. Oh, well, all her memory came back. Lucas, hit that like button. Yes, please. Yes, please. Thank you for the reminder. Y'all, rumor has it they'll patch the pumpkins farm. Mm -hmm. Wait, what? They'll patch the pumpkins? <gasps> like they're not going to be as wor worth as much as they are right now? Please tell me that's not so. I didn't realize how close the scar update was until I saw your post, Kay. Thanks. Yeah, you know, I wanted to keep y'all updated. When I saw it, I was like, let me go ahead and share. They better not patch them pumpkins, y'all. I will I will grind out the entire weekend so I have at least a million dollars. <laughs> a million star coins. Not star coins, but um, just a million coins because, no. They better not. Lisa, hello. Welcome in. You are not late. We are just getting started. Actually, I was a little late, to be honest. If you're just joining, we are working on Elsa's quest. So we need the pickled herring, which we have right here. So that's perfect. We need a white passion lily, a carrot, and a gold agate. So we need to run back to the house. Where are the passion lilies? I can never keep track of where the passion lilies are. Or the flowers in general. White passion lily. There it is. Ah, frosted heights. That's right. I knew I, I, I felt like it was frosted heights, but I need to double check. David, welcome in. How are you? I have 5 million coins, but still need to harvest my pumpkins I have right now. Oh, Aaron, you are going to be just fine then, huh? You are going to be just fine. I need to have 5 million gold star coins, okay? That's what I know. <laughs> yeah, Steph, we got to get... That's got to be our goal this weekend. We need to get to at least a million coins. Not confirmed, but I've seen like 10 comments saying this. Apparently, it's because people are breaking the game with all the pumpkins they plant. What? I mean, but isn't that like a major part of the game? Like, we got to be able to plant the pumpkins. Lisa, you hit 8 million coins today. That is insanity in the best way. In the best way. Y'all rich, rich, huh? 
Kimball, hello, welcome in. I hit three mil. Woo-hoo-hoo-hoo. I'm not even close to the mill. I'm in the 300 thous. <laughs> and I thought I was doing okay, but I am not. Peace, you just hit two mil too? Dang. Oh, thank you, Kimball. You like the house? I've been trying to do a little decorating here and there as we go. All right, we need one gold igot. I'm just going to split one off. Oh my gosh, I cannot wait for Elsa's dress. I've been so excited to see how this looks. Pretty good watching the stream with one eye and our new kitchen, uh, our new kitten with the other. Oh, you got a new kitten. That's so sweet. Did, I feel like you might have mentioned you had a new kitten. How is the little fella? That's so cute. Oh, what does Scrooge have in store today? We got a dress. Okay, we're going to have to go inside and see what Scrooge has. But let's go and finish up this Elsa quest. Oh, we need one carrot too. We need one carrot. Mimi, you've got 5.5 million and 230K Dreamlight. I am in shambles. <laughs> we got to get some pumpkins planted, y'all. If they... I Listen, I can't. I'm not going to be able to deal with it if they... If they do something to how much the pumpkins sell for. But maybe they're going to patch the pumpkins because they're going to release another harvestable that's going to be worth more. Maybe, right? That would be like the only other thing that makes sense. Rambunctious but adorable. Oh, rambunctious in the best way. Kittens are so freaking cute. Mimi, you have no life? Me either. And I'm still broke. <laughs> and I'm still broke. So I'm slacking. Dang it, I'm thinking I'm going to be okay with my 20K. I know. Not even. Me sitting with less than 20,000. <laughs> no, but for real though. Wait, what? Okay. Place the following items on the pedestal okay we have that oh that's a gold nugget we need a gold igot the passion the white passion lily goes here okay got it got it and then okay we know we need the so do we need to fish the actual fish i thought how's the pit how is the fish gonna be pickled coming out the water <laughs> How is that? Maybe it's not the pickled herring that I thought. Oh, it's extra pickled herring. We need regular pickled herring. Oh no, that's not good. We better hope that it rains soon, y'all. Might cut the cost uh, to extend the end game further. Could be. Kimball, I've been seeing people's um, valley designs, and it's insane. I literally saw something on Twitter, and I was like, I don't, I genuinely don't understand how y'all's brains work like this to make something so incredibly beautiful. Because I have no, I have no skill <laughs> in that area. Mystical, welcome in. Am I prepared for Scar? Barely, just barely. We still got a couple more quests to do, so I'm trying to do that. Okay, so we need the normal pickled herring. Yeah, so we're going to have to wait for it to rain in order to get the herring, right? Let me look at the recipe. Hi, Rachel. Welcome in. I don't think they will change sale prices on pumpkins. Probably fix it from crashing when you block your helper or limit how many crops per biome. Oh, hey, Chambers. Welcome back. How are you? Welcome in. Welcome in. We are just working on Elsa's quest. We're about to get that dress, I hope. If we can make this pickled herring recipe, where is it? Oh, we're all the way in the S's. We need to be in the P's. That's not the one that we need. Is that just regular herring? It is. I think we have everything we need. We're gonna be good. Let's try. 
<laughs> you, you feel me though? No, but barely. Like I'm just barely ready. I gotta get prepared. That's why. That's what we doing tonight, y'all. We have got to get it together. Yay! We have everything we need. I'm so excited. Hold the front door. Can someone tell me if crops disappeared? I just logged in after being off all week and all my crop plot. Oh, Chantel, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Yes, I think it's like after 48 hours or something like that. Your, if you don't have anything pl um, planted, then yes, all of your crops will disappear. Your crop plots anyway. I'm so sorry. But if you had plants in there, they shouldn't disappear. It was an appetizer. Okay, I found it. I found it. I know. I the same thing happened to me, Chantel. I had to literally redig everything. <laughs> I'm just gonna add Elsa's meal and Anna's meal because we need to improve the relationships, at least for Anna. I think uh, she wanted a cherry pie, which we can make. So let's do that. TTV, welcome in. Welcome back. How are you? I need to plan uh, that better in the plan that better in the future. Yeah, I got I was had like a little cold or something for like two days, and I logged in and was wow, I distraught. <laughs> wow. Okay, Anna, you happy to see me? I'm happy to see you, girl. Suburban. When oh. I saw the title, I got confused. I thought Scar update was already happening. I got so confused. Oh no no no! We we're just preparing for Scar. Ooh. Okay, we got Anna to level nine. Wonderful. Sorry for the confusion, though. Maybe I shouldn't have put Scar on the <laughs> thumbnail. People were probably like, what the heck? What did I miss? I'm going to panic plant pumpkins until the update. Oh, yeah, we're definitely planting some pumpkins this stream because I got to get to at least one mil. Y'all, I need more than Scar. Give me more. We have to wait for more, but I have no life. <laughs> we all want more. We do. Oh, there's a chest over here. Wait, I thought I made the... Oh, I haven't placed it. Okay, so we just need to make the gold igot. Grace, I think I did. This is it, right? The regular pickled herring? I thought I didn't for a second, too. I just had to double check. <laughs> I guess the silver lining is I wanted to reposition the layout of my plots and was dreading un undigging them. Oh, well, that that's, I guess, a benefit. Plus, this would be a good time now for you to be able to improve your digging buddy relationship. <laughs> hey, Pearson, I'm just waiting for more hardwood so I can complete the mini level 10 quest. That's what we're on right now. Well, we're on a quest similar. We have to we have to get a bunch of hardwood, clay, all that stuff. Is that the one you're on, Pearson? I'm still hoping they have male outfits for rewards, having dresses as rewards. It's not making me want to do the quest. You know what I think they should do, Mystical? I think that they should they should do the same thing that they have set up for Ariel. At the end, they should have like both I guess male or female or gender neutral clothing options. That would be good for every every level 10 friendship to give you something like that. Holly, hello, welcome in. So glad you caught your, my live again. Yes, I'm so glad you're here as well. Hi, Delightful. Welcome in. How are ya? Welcome, welcome. Guys, if you're just joining the live stream, we are working on Anna's level, or I'm sorry, Elsa's level 10 quest. We are about to get her dress. And if you're enjoying the live stream, please don't forget to give it a like. That'll help more friends find the channel, find the stream so we can hang out. All right, so this is the last thing. Oh no, I'm so excited. Okay, let's add it. Let's see what happens. <gasps> okay, talk to Elsa. Oh, there she is. I was like, where is she? Okay, sorry guys, you guys know how, you know what I gotta do. It's picture time. We gotta get some of these, well, no, you can't get them all in, so it doesn't matter. All right, or maybe if we go from the side. Ooh, look at that. I love how our eyes are like frosty. We kind of look really cool with eyes like that, right? That's a lesson that uh, a lesson learned that they disappear. Yeah, I learned the hard way. Clay in the Glade of Trust. That's Hello. the best place for it. Oh, because I need to use some Dreamlight magic. I guess we used our Dreamlight magic. <laughs> there, the ice yes. around the chest is gone. Let's see what I've hidden. <gasps> 
Y'all, this chest has been sitting there in that ice, and I've been wanting to get in there so bad. We're about to finally find out. What is it? Ooh, clothing. <gasps> we got the dress. We got the dress. Yes. She was hiding a dress. Why was she hiding a dress? Hi there. A gown? Let me see it. Uh huh. I remember now. This is one snowflake sewn into the lining. Oh. It was the first snowflake ever to fall in a valley. <laughs> because I brought snow here. But it was your idea. You wanted me to feel at home here. Oh. Well, we've certainly got uh, come far together, Dot. I remember everything now. Adventures, stories, the friendships I shared with everyone. Before I came here, the frosted heights were just rocky cliffs. I used my magic to transform them, and I was so happy that I can contribute to this wonderful place. Aww. Aww. That's actually so sweet. Thank you. You have been a marvelous friend, which is why I want you to keep this as a token of my appreciation. Thanks, girl. Real excited. You did a wonderful job. We got it. Are y'all ready for this outfit change? All right, so now we at least have um, Elsa with it uh, all full up on level 10. Her memories are back. We got her dress. Grace, those eyes look spooky. Now that I'm starting over, gonna start collecting a lot more so being ready for the quest will be easier. Yeah, that's actually a really good thing to do starting out because you can just stock up on everything. I think that's a wonderful idea. They should do more gender neutral options. Yeah, I agree. I feel like it's like the perfect in between because everybody working on quests then get to have like a cool outfit. Male, female, or gender neutral, whatever. Yes, Steph, we got the dress. Yes, so Kimball, in order to save it to your device, you have to hit um, that save icon. All right, guys. Are y'all ready? Where is it? Oh, we already got it. Okay, okay, okay. Are y'all ready? <laughs> We're about to both be ice queens, Grace. Come on. All right. <gasps> oh, wow. Look at the deep slits by her chest. Ooh, it's cinched at the waist. Come on, body. Come on, body. Yep, these wings definitely go much better. And then let's change the crown too. Oh, she looks so good. She looks so good. Yo, the outfits in the game though are, are really so good though. Okay, it's in hats. Let's go back to this crown. Yep, that does it. Stop it. I have a bunch of uh, customers at the nail shop scheduled for Tuesday. I don't know how I'll manage to keep my mouth shut about Disney and Scar. <laughs> I'll have to remember they don't care. Maybe they do, though. Maybe they do care. Um, Chambers, I need to work on, I think, Donald Duck is at level 9. Let me see. It's Donald Duck. Minnie Mouse is definitely one I need to work on. Uh, Maui. We could do some Prince Eric. And Anna is almost level 10, so we need to make sure we get her to level 10 as well. So yeah, we got a couple of people actually. Shoulder pads be banging. <laughs> got them pointy shoulders, baby. Do you like the dress, Chantel? Look at that. She's looking like a proper queen. TJ, you like the dress too? Ooh. She's giving fierce with the shoulders. I put the ice dress on. Wally saw me and waved and whistled. Wally, what do you think? Wally said, girl, get out of here. <laughs> I bet he was trying to compliment your outfit. Oh. Oh, this looks so good. I love it. I'm ready for new content. Everyone else is at uh, level 10. I decorated and collecting the pastime. Yeah, that's what I'm going to do too. Like at towards, once I finish all the quests, it's definitely going to be time to decorate. All right, let's see what there is to purchase today. All of this stuff I kind of have, except for this candlestick. I want that. Thank you much. I'll take the candlestick. I don't have this dress, but I don't know if I want that dress for 40K. 
Oh. Greetings, neighbor. Ooh, red pearl clasp heels. Not the pearl clasp heels, y'all. <laughs> it's not uh, Minnie's level 10, but I'm so close. I only need like 40 hardwood. I know it's the hardwood that's going to be hard. And the clay. Hi, Ray. How are you? Oh, that's so sweet. Hello, Ray. Everyone in the chat says hello, too. It's even prettier in the light. It is, right? Okay, we're getting the shoes. Whoa, ho, ho, ho. Thank Time you, Scrooge. <laughs> let's look at these glasses. I mean, let's just buy them just because. <laughs> I wish Scrooge would only sell things that you um, do not have. Yeah, I know. I guess maybe they did it so that they could keep the store stocked up. All right, got to get the green mite bag because we have all of the other bags. Oh, greetings, neighbor. Don't want the watch. <laughs> Cuddly, welcome back. How are you? Oh, yes, the rug is greetings, happening. Neighbor. I've been waiting on rugs. I want rugs so bad. Okay, so this homey rug. <laughs> 4,000, that's nothing. We'll take that. Thank y'all. Thank you much. It's a desk, and that chair is just kind of, mm, just kind of okay. All right, perfect. You know what else we could do since we have some money is upgrade everything. We could maybe fully upgrade um, Scrooge's store is done. I think Remy's restaurant needs to be upgraded again. Let's see how much that is. We got the money. I know Scrooge is literally so happy. Okay, if you add some improvements to Chef Remy, our we chef can handle more orders. That means happier customers. 25? Let's do it. Ah, isn't that a sight? What a fine establishment. You're sure to see me back here real soon. How much bigger can this restaurant get? Oh, boy. <laughs> hey, all right. Chez Reme is fully grown. Look at that. It looks amazing. Y'all are always in here eating. Both of you guys are always in here. Y'all, somebody tell me, why does Anna sit like this? She is sitting like, like she waiting for somebody to come in and bring her a whole sack of money. <laughs> Jamie, you finally made Kristoff's stall. Nice. Now you got some, um, some good things to buy from there. Since Ariel's gotten her legs, I haven't seen her in the ocean. Does anyone know if she will go back and forth? Uh-oh. Oh, I thought I was stuck. Um, you know what? I think it was unfortunate because a couple of people were saying that she doesn't go back and forth. Suburban, you haven't found Ariel yet? Ooh, you will. Okay, we need to buy some pumpkins for sure. And here's what we should do. So the next person, let's get Anna. Let's run back and go get Anna really quickly because we could use... Well, no, let's just give her a, a special gift because that'll probably get her up to level 10 quickly. Hey, you're here. Let's yeah. hang out. Hello, my friend. Uh, I have something to give you. She wants maki, purple impotence, and steamed fungu. Why, thank fugu, you. fugu. Oh, she wants some expensive gifts today, y'all. Yeah, I unfortunately don't think that she is going she does goes back between land and water. She at least hasn't in my game since she got legs. But I'm hoping that something they'll change because it would be nice that she went back and forth. Especially because the dialogue with that quest was like, oh, now I have the ability to shapeshift, you know, back and forth. So it would be nice if she could do that. So beautiful. Love it. I made and designed costumes and gowns. I'm thinking about making some of um, the beautiful gowns from Dreamlight Valley. Ooh, you should. So you hand make and design costumes? That's awesome, Tracy. Peter, welcome back. How are you? Well, duh, Elsa was a queen, so it's expected for her to have expensive taste. I mean, obviously, right? Uh-oh, my crop plot that was here is all gone. Mm-mm-mm. Let's harvest all this stuff up. I genuinely don't need any more lemons. But we'll collect all the sticks. Yeah, I agree, Tracy. I think that's a great idea. Ooh, we almost don't need any more mushrooms either. Let's 
Someone ought to suggest that thing about area and Dreamlight Valley in the Discord group. Yeah, we could definitely do that. I think it would be helpful to know. I mean, I'm pretty sure they already have. Someone's probably already said something because we can't be the only ones that feel that way, right? Oh, look at y'all. That's so supportive. I love it. Do it, do it, do it. And the game is so popular right now, I could just imagine people would love to have something they could maybe like cosplay in or dress up and something like that. Okay, so we got all those sticks. That's another thing I wish. I wish foraging for sticks was considered foraging. Because <laughs> why is it not? How do you get Minnie Mouse? So you get Minnie Mouse by uh, leveling up your relationship with Mickey Mouse. So work on their relationship and you should start getting quests for him. I built a glass gazebo today. What a grind. Ooh. I'm sure it took an extraneous amount of glass. <laughs> okay, let's also go over here. We need to go get some of the fish that I know are just waiting to be taken from Moana's stall. I know. Where, who isn't even inviting these night thorns back? I need them to stay away. Ooh, she had some good fish in there today, too. Absolutely not. Go away. Go away. Go away. Thank you. All right, so next quest we're working on. We'll get Anna to level 10. Um, we need to... Ugh. Oh, gosh. We need 30 iron agates. Oh, boy, 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 boy. That's a lot. Um, we also... Okay, we'll get a quest unlock when we get Anna to level 10. Hmm. Yeah, so we just need to work on all of our friendships. But the quest that we're on right now is Ariel wants to show us something. So she found a mysterious stone slab covered in ancient ruins. Maybe Merlin knows what it means. So we need to talk to Merlin. Jazz, welcome back. You were just watching some old streams. Nice. Look at us, back in another life together. 200 dried wood? Oh, no. That's even more rare. Esta, hello. I'm good. How are you? All right, should I go buy pumpkins, y'all? Y'all got me scared. I'm going to go buy some pumpkins. <laughs> I'm going to go buy pumpkins because, baby, I need I need my money. <laughs> I need my money before they make any changes, okay? I need all that. I almost made a big mistake. I almost harvested my pumpkins without a gardening buddy. Oh, no. That would be tragic. All right, let's improve his stall to 12,000. <laughs> 12,000 to improve the stall. This is just getting more expensive. Okay, so we've got potatoes and pumpkins now. So that's where the potatoes are from. The Forgotten Lands. We'll do it for another 25. Let's just upgrade the stall all the way. We got the money. I just spent all my money on pumpkins. I'm about to play it. 450 pumpkins. That means you're probably going to get like close to what? 800 pumpkins back then? Right? Or am I thinking am my math off on that? Okay, garden now. We're going to garden. I'm scared too. I'm sitting farming and harvesting. <laughs> Let's get all these pumpkins planted right now. 450 pumpkins? That's a grind. I like doing this when I have a lot of my other um, buddies up to level 10 because it still improves our relationship as I'm like planting and stuff. You got 400. I'm about to get more pumpkins. I only bought 200, but I'm going... I'm trying to go 400 pumpkins, too. Because 200 pumpkins ain't enough. This is moving so slow. No! <gasps> Not me randomly planting corn. I'm in for a rough night. <laughs> we all are. Hi, Alex. Welcome in. I'm so sorry, but I had to share the info just in case. What info? 
Oh, no, 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 Theodora, yes. No, that is valuable information. Don't be sorry. We needed to share that. That needed to be known because we would have logged on and been like, why are the pumpkins only worth 50 gold now? What is this? And during Halloween month, what a coincidence. I keep saying this, but wouldn't it have been so cool if we could actually, like one of the quests was for us to actually grow a giant pumpkin for the pumpkin house. I think that would be such a fun quest. Like you probably have to tend to it for like five days or something. I'm harvesting 710 pumpkins right now. Oh, that's insane. Oh yeah, Peter, my math was off. Just ignore me. My weakest subject is math. It will always be off. <laughs> After work Wednesday, and I'll be watching any live streams that day with my phone on silent. That's okay. Lurk away. Lurk away. Oh, my God. I totally play that quest. Maybe Jack Skeleton can come to the Valley and the Pumpkin King himself, right? I feel like that would be just so much fun. Like, you, maybe it'd be something crazy. Like, you need to water it, like, ten days in a row or something, and you grow this giant pumpkin, and then that's how you move in the valley member that was going to live in the pumpkin. That would have been such a cool quest, I think. I will be so poor if they actually nerfed the pumpkin worth. Oh, I know. We would all be broke. If they nerfed the sell price, it would probably wouldn't be much, maybe, like, 100 gold. If they add an extra watering, I'm not going to lie to you, I'm not planting pumpkins. <laughs> if they add an extra watering for pumpkins, they might as well go ahead and, and put an upgrade on that watering can. I don't care. I don't care. Upgrade the watering can. Make it easier to water these crops. <laughs> Jazz, you're so excited for the update next week. What do you think it will consist of? I'm ready to um, replay they made there will be a lot more to do once the update comes out. So what I can see, right, from the little thumbnail that they released is that there is going to be um, crows. So I think we're going to get a new critter because there were definitely crows in the background. There's a cave entrance. So we're going to have a new either maybe it's a new home as well. A new home for somebody or maybe like a new cave to explore for a quest. And then there was some mysteri like, mysterious rock back there. Did you guys see that glowing rock in the back of the thumbnail? Mad Max, hello! Welcome in, how are you? Welcome back. Oh, I want spr- I want- I would pay a million gold coins for one sprinkler. <laughs> Literally. It was just a rumor, but we think so. It's a possibility. They've, they've nerfed some things before, right? Okay, we watered those up surprisingly fast. Oh, look, a purple impotent. Let's go ahead and give that to oh, uh, Anna, because I think that's one of the gifts that she wanted. Oh, no. She wanted a shiny amethyst. Oh, we can easily give her that stuff. We'll talk more soon, okay? Wait, wait, wait. Time waster. We're going to blow the same king. Uh-oh, Theodora looking for people Team Scar now. Oh, Team Scar. All right, let's go back to the valley because we have more pumpkins to plant. Oh, Alex, you haven't unlocked pumpkins yet? Yeah, see, like, that's the thing. Like, people still have some work to do. Like, people need to experience... Everyone needs to experience what it's like to sell at least 100 pumpkins. This place is it's a beautiful, beautiful thing. Oh, this place is the cat's pajamas. <laughs> it would be cool if they introduced Finding Nemo to the game. We can make us um, make use of one of the oceans and swim. That's exactly what I was thinking, Alyssa. I was thinking the same thing. Like, how cool would it be to have, like, an, the ability to at least swim? Or an underwater biome. Oh, that would be so good. The rumors could be false. They could be false. We'll just have to wait and see, I guess. Only like five days or so now, right? Next Wednesday? They usually do nerf things that are overpowered. Yeah, because they've done it before, right?
Scrooge's prices are ridiculous. You know the man is just doing whatever he can <laughs> to get his dollars up. Scrooge said, I need to get my money up too before Scar get here. <laughs> we don't know what's going to happen when Scar arrive. <laughs> I need all my coins. Good old Mick Scammer. Right now, I use canola to make money and plant 200 of that at a time. That's actually really good too. Canola and onions are really, really good. I actually prefer onions over canola because onions you only have to water twice, I believe. <laughs> it would be good if his prices were just less chaotic. Like, can you just not charge $40,000 for one dress, please? Thanks. Ooh, they already have wetsuits in the game? I don't even think I've seen a wetsuit yet, but it's like, hey, wetsuits in the game already is a no-brainer. Just let us swim. What's my favorite Halloween movie? You know, I'm gonna honestly have to say, and I haven't watched the second one yet, but Hocus Pocus is definitely one of my faves. But I'm not gonna lie to y'all, I like real scary movies, like the real scary ones. I'm a little bit more of a scaredy cat today though, but I, I like them scary, scary movies. Like, what's the, what's, let me think of one that's real scary. What's the scariest, actual scary movie I've ever seen? Hmm. I know which one I'm thinking about, but I can't think about the name right now. What is that? What is that movie called? Um, where the family, they're in the house, and they have the two exorcism specialists come, and the mother gets possessed. Y'all know which one I'm talking about? Like, Exorcist was hands down one of the scariest for sure, Grace. I completely, Insidious was scary too, Mad Max, but it's not Insidious, it's not Exorcist. Conjuring, yep, Kimball, Conjuring. Some people, I know that it's like mixed, like some people was like, that movie's not scary at all, but I legit was so terrified that I was in tears at the last, like at the end of that movie when like she was in a chair and the sheet started to rip over her face and it was like a different face under there. Oh, I legit, I, I was, I was just, I was losing it. I said, I can't be watching this. <laughs> hereditary, people didn't like Hereditary too, but that movie is hands down terrifying to me. Like the people in the back that are just kind of like in the shadows and they're just smiling. I'm like, for some reason it's, scarier to me when people are just standing around like smiling in a weird speaking of have you guys seen the trailer for the new scary movie um smile i think that's what it's called i heard it was terrifying it's been all over youtube the trailer i haven't seen halloween ends is it good is it scary I was supposed to watch Hereditary this year. Yeah, Hereditary is one of those ones it's like it doesn't have a bunch of jump scares. It has like the creepy like it's just someone's in the room with you type of scary shit. <laughs> and it's terrifying. It's terrifying. All right, let's head back cuz I want to buy I'm not going to plant any more pumpkins right now, but I want to buy some more pumpkins. Steph, you can't watch scary scary movies. Kimball the Conjuring House was legit down the street from my ex's house. Oh no. Absolutely not. I couldn't even walk past that house and I know it's a I know it's a movie and it's not real, but I legit would not be able to do it. Wonderful. Okay, we've got plenty of pumpkins now. They ain't nerfing me, baby. <laughs> oh, let's catch this fish. Oh, that is definitely a pickaxe. There we go. It was good. Oh my gosh, I'm waiting for Smile Love Horror. Theodora, we are in the same boat then because I can't wait to watch that movie. Even though I know, like I heard it is terrifying. Carly, hello, welcome in. I'm the person who is in a hurry to get to the remote and change the channel. <laughs> like, you know what, this was fun, but I'm actually, I'm gonna go now. <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and head out. Last time I watched a scary movie was when I was in high school. It was a nightmare on Elm Street. I ended up underneath the kitchen table. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. You know what movie had me like, like I couldn't sleep 
was it. I have like an unrealistic debt. Like I have a, a real unrealistic fear of clowns. And I think it's probably because of that movie. But it is so incredibly terrifying to me. I can't. Heather, welcome back. How are you? I lived in the town that the Amityville horror movies were based off of. Oh my goodness, no. Oh my goodness, no. This makes me want to watch a scary movie though. Oh, I want to watch a scary movie real bad now. That movie scared you too when you were a kid? Yeah, I was definitely way too young to be watching that movie. I'm not even gonna lie to you. Okay, Merlin's at home. So let's go talk to him about this slab. Someone I know watched Smile recently and they were scared for a week or more after watching it. <gasps> Alex, I heard the same review. I don't know if I should watch it if it's that scary though. Cause I am like a vivid dreamer. I will have a nightmare. Suburban, you saw it? Yeah, it freaked me out big time. Especially, oh my gosh. I'm literally getting goosebumps just thinking about it. <laughs> okay, hmm, a stone slab covered in carvings, or rather, runes. Is that what these are? Ariel found it near some sort of door in, the ca in a cave near Dazzle Beach. Do you know what it is? Well, it's likely a key of some kind, but as for what might behind be behind the door, I can't be certain. You know, I've always thought there were people who walked the island long before any of us did. Dreamlight Valley is old, Dot. Very old. Yeah, it is Halloween month, so it's the time to watch the scary movies. But I really need to see Hocus Pocus 2, too. I need to just have a movie night. Maybe I'll do that this weekend. Watch Us if you've never seen it, okay? So Us is so creepy. I used to work in an amusement park popular for scary mazes the clowns oh my i can't do i can't do a maze with the clown. i would literally run away in terror screaming out loud people would think i was hurt <laughs> yeah it's something about like people like people frozen standing still just staring at you and smiling like just creeps me out like it just seems like something is wrong Oh, Alyssa, the Paranormal Activity movie scared me so bad. I remember that. Oh my God, that one was so terrifying. I was too young to watch that movie too. Yeah, Clouds is a, is a hell no for you, girl. Okay, even older than you? No way. I'll have you know that for a wizard, I barely, I'm barely a whippersnapper. I haven't the faintest idea who the people were, but these ruins must have been their language. I've seen them in various spots around the village, but I've only just begun to decipher their meaning. Let me see. Take your time. <laughs> Aha! I believe I know what it says. The people who made this door wanted to be sure no one could pass through it alone. You'll need something from the other villagers to get inside. Okay. Hey, Des! Welcome back. It's so good to see you. I just looked up the smile trailer and nope, won't be seen. <laughs> Danielle said, let me see what y'all talking about. It's a uh, hell no. Yep. The people who made this door wanted to be sure no one could pass through it alone. You'll need something from other villagers to get inside. Um, tools? Tools? No, no. I'm afraid tools will do you no good. It seems the other people who wrote these runes trusted only emotions in the power of stories. To open the door, you'll have to enchant this stone slab by filling it with fiery passion, seething anger, perfect joy, and exuberant excitement. Mmm. Maybe fiery passion is Remy. He has a passion for cooking. Seething anger is Donald Duck. Perfect joy. Ooh, that one's a hard one. Perfect joy maybe be Mickey or Minnie Mouse. Exuberant excitement. Goofy? Perfect joy, maybe Wally? Hmm. Okay, you think the captain and Otto will be added to the game? It's Listen, I think they may consider adding everybody to the game. Or is that just too much? I listened to this podcast called The Newly Witches, and they talked about the story of the speed freak killers. It's possible that they might be real people. Oh, my. I don't like that. I hate Ronald McDonald clown. <laughs> I literally can't see clowns. I just, I just, I can't look at them. It's too much for me. My mind just goes, no, absolutely not. Huh? How do I do that? 
Why you simply find four villagers and have them hold the stone slab while they feel each emotion. Sounds like I have my work cut out for me. Perhaps Ariel can help you figure out which villagers best embody the emotions you're looking for. Well, they run along now. I think I know Merlin. I think they're going for the classics for the clues K in the game. Okay, so classics. Definitely Mickey and Minnie, right? Goofy Donald Mickey. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Des, I'm so glad to hear you're doing good. Okay, where's Ariel? We know she out here walking around somewhere. There she is. She's coming up the beach now. Does anyone know if the items in your storage chest count towards your 600 limit? Mimi, that's a good question. Because I do not know the answer to that. Okay, we're going to give her the slab. Also, I have no clue how to unlock Ariel. Do you have to level up your friendship oh, with Ursula? Um, Ariel, yes, it was. I think it was Ursula. Was it Ursula? I think it was Ursula. I'm deflowering every biome just to level someone up once. Yeah, I, uh, Pearson, I literally spammed flowers to Ursula and Ariel to get their friendship up. So, Des, today we are working on grinding it out, trying to get a lot of these quests done before the SCAR update comes next week. So, we're really super excited. We just got Elsa to level 10, and you can see we're wearing her dress, and now we're working on a quest for Ariel. I weirdly know a lot of people who went to clown college. There's a clown college? Was Merlin able to help? He told me that this is some sort of key we can use to open the door, but first we need to enchant it with emotions. Fiery passion, seething anger, anger, perfect joy, and exuberant excitement. Perfect joy? Oh, I can help with that. You're such a wonderful friend. After all, you saved me from a desert desert island. Whether I think of you, when I whenever I think of you, I always feel joy. Aw. Wait, I feel like the magic is working. You did it, Ariel. Then we just have three more to go. I know just who to talk to about fiery passion. Remy, no one's more as passionate about food as he is. Okay, I figured that one was Remy because he has real passion. Okay, let's get to Remy. Please don't be asleep. Oh, he's at his house. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. We gotta get over there, we gotta get over there fast. For whatever re reason, Remy has been trying to go to bed lately on us. Ooh, a movie night. I love movies now. I, can you stream movies? Like, could we stream a movie together and watch it? Is that what you guys are talking about? Streaming a movie? Has a clown college. Oh my gosh. Are we making a Discord to do movie nights? Are we? Is this a thing? We're hinting it. Ooh, I'm down. Ashley, welcome in. Hi, everyone. Just made some brownies. Now settling in to play along. Oh, what I'd give for a brownie right now. Mmm, brownie sounds so good. Where's Remy at? And why is he not in here? He's always in bed when I start playing. Doesn't help that lately all my free time is in the evening. Same. There he is. Before you go back inside. Can you hold this for Hello. me, please, Remy? Yes, you can share screens to stream movies on Discord. Ooh, okay, I was planning on making a Discord too, so maybe we should, you guys. Oh, focus on the quest before Remy sleeps. <laughs> Thanks, Grace. I know you gotta keep me on track. Thank you, y'all, thank you. Okay, oh, hey, Dot, what's up? Let's talk about your passion for cooking. Um, we're doing an experiment. I'm gonna guess it's not a cooking experience. So, as you might have noticed, I'm a rat, and rats aren't usually chefs or interested in fine cuisine. <laughs> but the first time I tasted a really good meal, I was hooked. And when I combined my first ingredients, <laughs> the thrill of discovery, the artistry of combining flavors to create something new, I knew I had found my calling. Oh, I, I, I love that. That actually makes me feel passionate. Okay, and now every time I cook, it's the same feeling all over again. I gotta tell you, it's pretty great. 
You did it. You enchanted the stone slab with fiery passion. Thank you, Remy. Sure, happy to help. Now I have to find someone willing to talk about exuberant mm -hmm. excitement. Then you'll definitely need to talk to Moana. She came into my restaurant the other day and was going on and on about what kick she gets out of sailing. Talk to Moana. Got it. Thanks. Hope to see you soon. Yeah, Ursula's always sleeping now, and Moana, oh my goodness, she's in the house too. We gotta get there before she falls asleep. Yes, yes, thank you for the reminder, TJ. If you guys are enjoying the stream, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up. It'll help more friends find the stream so we can all hang out. And thank you so much to everybody who's already gave the stream a thumbs up. I really, really appreciate oh, it, you guys. Thank you so much. Idea. Oh, I have an idea. Okay, Moana, look. I got the stone slab, girl. Here. Hi. Lisa, you could really go for a brownie, right? Yeah, why is Kristoff behind me humming? He needs to get away from me. Angelina, welcome in. I'm waiting on my on Remy to wake up to complete one of my Ariel quests. I know. And they, I just wish we had the option to walk in the house and wake him up. Okay, hey, Dot, what's the stone slab for? Well, I have sort of a weird question to ah. ask you. Sure, what is it? I need you to hold on that stone slab and tell me how you feel when you go sailing in the ocean. <laughs> okay, that's a little strange, but I always love to talk Ooh. about sailing. When I'm out in the ocean with the salt air whipping around me and the wind in my sails headed for the horizon, I know where I belong. It's the greatest <laughs> feeling in the world. The way you describe it, it sounds so amazing. I want to go ah. sailing. I'm sure you'd love it. Mm. Hey, that stone slab you gave me, it's starting to glow. Does that mean I helped? Yes, it worked. Now I need to go find someone who's got seething anger. Y'all know that's Donald Duck. Well, Ursula gets pretty mad if you mention Ariel around her. Ursula? Ursula? Now, I thought I wasn't going to have to talk to Ursula again. Man. And Ursula be trying to go to bed, too. Let's find out where she's at. Thank goodness she's not in her house. Okay. Ursula, Ursula. Where is Ursula? She's not up there. Ah. She's in the glade or the sunlit plateau. Okay, good, good, good. I'm focused, I'm focused. Yes, we should. I catch myself wanting to randomly share something with all of you during the day. No, you don't sound lonely. We're friends. We all get to hang out. Okay, I'll make the Discord. I'll work on that. I shall work on that, I promise. Okay, now we gotta talk to Ursula, y'all. Seriously, how much sleep does one little rat need? Ah, <laughs> uh, Dot, what brings you by, Angelfish? I need your help with an enchantment. Intriguing, of course. You know you can't get something for nothing. You'll have to offer something in return. It's not a big deal. Aaron and I, we just need... Ah, don't speak that name of that simpering... Simpering? Little ninny in my presence. Ninny? Oh, my... I'm tired of seeing her mop of red hair and hearing that bleeding siren of a singing voice around the village. All right, Ursula's taking it too far. That's disrespectful. I don't like that. I don't like that at all, Ursula. The stone slap. The runes are glowing. You filled it with seething anger. Angry? Me? Don't be the ridiculous. You definitely seem mad, girl. You sound like a hater, actually, to be honest. Wait, why do I get the feeling you just tricked me? Because I did. No. Bye. Oh, you'll regret this, Dot. I promise you. Girl, I won't Why regret nothing. Matter of fact, here. No. Take some water for your troubles so you can cool off. <laughs> if a character is needed for a quest, they will wake up sleeping, then go right back to bed. My characters oh, never do that. Oh, yes, I love my, I love, love, I know a lot of people don't, but I really do love my, um, my brownies with nuts in them. Oh, and milk, yes. Oh, yeah, Discord is definitely, it's a, it's another little animal. I definitely got to figure that out. <laughs> I'm right with you, Steph. We can work together and figure it out. Or maybe I can, if you figure out anything or if I figure out anything, I can share with you. Oh, Alex, thank you so much for coming. I hope you have a wonderful night. Hopefully I didn't say that too late. I think I might have missed you. 
Why couldn't it have been Donald? I know Donald literally has a conniption every day. So I don't know why it's not Donald, but okay. All right, so now we need to figure out where to place the stone slab in the mystical cave. Uh-oh. What's behind the door? This is a pretty cool chat. The people here are really nice. I don't normally talk on streams unless it's just to offer up the player tip. And TJ, you've been you've been a great help. So thank you. I'm so glad you are interactive in the chat. Yeah, our community is amazing. I love you guys. You guys are awesome. Jeez, Ursula, chill out. I'm saying, though, like, why are you acting like that? She a hater. She just mad because she don't have legs. <laughs> I just harvested and sold all my pumpkins. Now I'm just hanging out and watching. Cool. How much money did you get for your pumpkins? Okay, I feel like the slab goes here, right? <gasps> it does go here. Not the door just being gone. Not me and this stone matching. We look good, y'all. Look at our dresses like glowing in here. This is so nice. Yeah, I had to pour water on her. Girl, calm down. <laughs> You're doing too much, Ursula. We don't like all that. Okay, perfect. I like a little something. <laughs> My brownies. <laughs> something spacey. Kind of. Maybe, maybe JK. Maybe a little. <laughs> Okay, Steph, yeah, we could work on it. Because I got to learn, too. I was, was going to watch some YouTube videos and stuff to figure it out. And I will let you guys know in the next stream or on the community tab, too, once I have a Discord all worked out and stuff. So we can join it. We'll have another place where we can all hang out. I think the Discord might be even a better place for me to update you guys on, like, stream schedules and stuff like that, too. Because I feel like, like you guys said, YouTube notifications aren't really the best sometimes. So... Discord could be a really good place for us to kind of stay up to date on things, you know? Where are the, where's the other one? Oh, it's right here. Yes. We got it. TJ, you love to help. And I love that you love to help because you're super helpful. Libby, the nicest chat for real. No, really. You guys really make these streams like what they are. Y'all are awesome. Another magical crystal. So we need to meet Ariel at her house. <gasps> Wait. You guys. You guys. Peep something. Peep something right now with me. What does this rock right here look like? What is this? What does this crystal look like, guys? I know y'all recognize it. Princess Luca, welcome in. This this crystal looks like the crystal that's in the thumbnail in the update. Yes, Jazz, you got it. Yes. Does that not look like... Y'all go look on Twitter right now. Is that not the rock in the background? Because I swear it is. I swear it's in the thumbnail, y'all. I swear it is. I know my memory sims serves me right. I swear it's in the thumbnail. Does it look like the crystal from Atlantis Lost Empire? Maybe it is. That's the update rock. I wonder if they surprise us with a new biome or something. I know. That's crazy. It looks exactly like that rock. Ooh, we might be onto something, y'all. We might be onto something, y'all. This is why we had to get prepared. This is why. Chantel, if you go to Disney Dreamlight Valley on Twitter, like you go to their page, you'll see that the thumbnail is, thumbnail is there and you'll be able to see it in the thumbnail. I followed them on Twitter because that's where they post a lot of their updates. A new biome, I would, I would be so incredibly excited. This looks exactly like the crystal in the thumbnail, y'all. I'm pretty sure. Okay, let's give her the this crystal. Let's see. Hi. Okay, this went to all the... They went through all the trouble to hide this little crystal like this. 
You know, it's funny. It looks just like the crystals on some of the artifacts I found while I was on that deserted island. All of this stuff, it must have been made by people who lived here a long time ago before the forgetting. Before any of us came to the valley. What are they hinting at right now? They keep saying before we came to the valley. I'm so glad that we found out about this together, Dot. It can be our secret. You're a true friend. Can't wait for our next adventure. I'm going to say can't wait for our next adventure. Me too. I have so much fun uncovering mysteries around the village with you. I want you to have this to thank you for everything. Just know. I just know you'll look amazing when we go on our next adventure. What is it? <gasps> oh, I just I just realized this is the level 10 quest for Ariel too. Oh my gosh, we got two dresses on the stream, y'all. We got two dresses. <laughs> Oh. Oh, wait a minute. Look at these things. Could these be... Could these be a part of it? If you go to your menu under collections and look under furniture sets, down towards the bottom is the ancient civilization and that symbol for it reminds me of Atlantis. <gasps> Hold on. We're doing this right now. Okay, so you said go to the collections menu and then go to furniture sets all the way to the bottom. Oh, it's a long way down, too. Wait, wait, wait. Did I miss it? Deanna! Hello, Deanna. How are you? I think I'm... I don't think I have it. All the way down towards the bottom, it says Ancient Civilizations. The Lion King, Cinderella, Wreck-It Ralph, Beauty and the Beast, Ratatouille, Moana, Dreamlight Valley, Sword in the Stone. I don't see it. Oh, I just passed it. Tangled monsters, Toy Story. Oh, oh, those do look like the symbols. It's right here. <gasps> they just haven't added any furniture yet. Y'all, we are uncovering some stuff here. Is it Atlantis? Is it gonna be Atlantis? Deanna, you love Dot's dress. This is um, this is uh, Elsa's dress. I know it's so pretty, right? I'm definitely Grace. It's <laughs> you know my brain be all over the place. I just scroll right past it. Yes, it makes me so much more excited for the update too because if this stone that we just did for Ariel has something to do with it and we have another stone coming in the update, then we're getting closer to probably learning more about the ancient civilization. <sighs> Could you imagine? Okay, let's go out. Well, actually, let's not go out. There's good lighting in here. So let's try on the dresses in here. Ooh. Oh, this one's really beautiful too, y'all. Look at this dress. They did so good with the dresses. Flowers girl, welcome back. How are you? I'm so glad you caught the stream too. I'm jumping in my seat. Me too, Heather. <laughs> this dress is really beautiful. All right, what's y'all favorite dress out of these three down here? We've got Moana's dress so far. Beautiful, absolutely gorgeous. We've got Ursula's dress. I mean, that is just gorgeous. You've got Elsa's dress. And now Ariel's dress. The detail in the dresses are crazy. They go crazy. All right, we got Elsa's, Ariel's, my favorite Moana's. I love Moana's. I know, I might I might be really in love with uh, Ursula's, I'm not going to lie. Teddy, welcome back. Anderson, I'm working on getting Anna's dress as we speak. Tough, I love Moana's. Elsa's dress, Ursula's too iconic, I agree. 
Okay, so let's wear the. Oh, let's check out the suit too. Co so I think it's under costumes. Now this is this is player right here. Yeah, this is this is that's good looking. That's money. Okay. Walk up in Scrooge store like what? What was said? What was said, Scrooge? <laughs> what was it? Stop. Stop playing with me. <laughs> the Ursula. I love the whole Ursula look. I think it might be my favorite. Sweet. Welcome in. Mine would be the ice gown, but my thick thighs keep picking out. Yeah, my thighs keep coming out of them, too. We can love them all. It's okay. It's okay, bed bags. We can love them all. It's good because we can just per we can change outfits on how we feel, you know. Teddy, you're not you're not that late. No worries, no worries. The thing about I think um, cause this dress I absolutely love. This is hands down one of my favorites. But I just wish we had like a complete look, like maybe a hat or some jewelry, a back accessory, something to go with it. All right, let's keep Ariel's gown on for right now. We truly look like royalty right now, though. Boss business, babe. Yes. It's definitely giving. Definitely giving boss, babe. Yeah, that's beautiful. No worries, Suburban. No worries. Bracelets would be nice. Yeah, like some bracelets. Something. A seashell crown. Oh! <gasps> A seashell crown would be so good. Oh my gosh, a seashell crown would be so good. Okay, so let's get Anna's friendship up to level 10 so we can get her dress as well. Yeah, like if we had a crown or something with that dress, I would be I would definitely be wearing that 24/7. Like the one thing I love about Ursula's dress is that it's like a full outfit. We can get wings, the crown, the nails, you know, and it's like a complete look. So I really like that. Oh my God, flowers would look so good too. Okay, Anna, I think she said she wanted a fish dish. Let's see. She wanted gazpacho and savory fish. That's no problemo. That's no problemo. Oh my gosh, more wings. What else could be cool? What else could be cool on the back? Like something else mystical besides wings. Like a staff, maybe like some staffs would be cool. Like could you imagine if there was like some thorny or like um, like a, a greenery weeded like wooden staff? That would be so cool. You know, like Merlin's staff that he walks around with. Okay, so let's go to gazpacho. I, every time I hear gazpacho, I want gazpacho so bad. I told my boyfriend to design a piece of clothing for me just because. In game, the man spent hours. I now have so many dresses and ears and even backpacks. He went all in. Oh, I love that. About to tell my husband, to get on in here and design me some clothes. He would make me something ugly on purpose. <laughs> There's a dress in Scrooge's store. Yeah, I, that dress is in there right now for forty thousand. Ooh, a jetpack. Imagine if we could actually use the jetpack too. Uh oh, I'd be flying all around. Maleficent staff. Ooh, if they add Maleficent, maybe they'll add staffs. A staff would be so good. I feel like. Oh, you know what? I don't know the recipe for savory fish. That's okay. She's almost, she's real close to level hey, 10. you're here. <gasps> Ooh, a hooded cape. Mad Max. That is so good. That is so good. A hooded cape would be so awesome. Let's give her this gazpacho. We did it. We're level 10. Oh. Eve's blaster. Oh, yes. Any fish and one lemon. Thank you, TJ. I'll make that right now so I have the recipe. If they fix time traveling in the game to be not glitchy, do you think you would? I, time traveling in, like, I could be, it might be nighttime here, but I could be playing in the daytime. Is that what the time traveling is? Wow. 
am I happy to see you. I'm not sure. I'm worried about Elsa. She's been really frustrated lately. What's wrong? Tell me everything. Uh. I guess stuff at the cavern isn't going the way she'd like. She hasn't figured out a solution yet. Elsa gets quiet when she's upset, and she tends to go off by herself. I was thinking we could do something to remind her that there's a world outside full of people who care for her. Well, I mean, she's always at the restaurant, but I guess, girl, it's fine. Maybe a gift would cheer her up. A gift? That's a great idea. What about something that will remind Elsa of our childhood oh, together? Yes, I'm absolutely exhausted. Mad Max, you're making savory fish right now? Oh, that would be perfect. I have a book with drawings of our family in my house. Let's go get it. We'll talk okay. More okay. Yeah, exactly. Sometimes when I'm, oh, I absolutely, if they fix time traveling, I would absolutely change the time so that we could play during the day because I love nighttime, but it would be nice for us to be able to play during different times of the day for sure. Like I would even time travel to make it like sunset, like when the sun's going down or something. It's just so beautiful during the day. Oh Lord, please Lord, tell me. Oh no. Kristoff is sleeping y'all. They gotta fix this. They gotta fix this. They gotta fix this. <laughs> no. I freaking knew it. I had a feeling. I had a feeling Kristoff ass was gonna be asleep. Why is he asleep? It's 1024 at night. I could see that being helpful for some people that can only play during a certain time of the day. Yeah. Cause I can only play with you guys at night most of the time right now. I got the 40,000 dress. It's so pretty. It would look amazing on you. I'm going to go buy it. I'm going to buy it. TJ, you had to restart all the way over? Why? Get these night thorns out of here. Yeah, see, this is the canola. It needs to be watered again. Okay, Anna, actually, let's see. Maybe we can catch her going inside of her house again. Bye, let's hang out later. I wish there was the option, like, they added it in for some of the characters, like, let's go see your house. And for some reason, not everybody has it. Kristoff needs that beauty sleep? Obviously. I mean, he done got all his memories back, but he don't spend no time with Anna. What's the problem? I know, I'm sick. I can't believe it. I wanted to see this dress so bad. And Anna just will not go home. <laughs> I just sat here and water all my pumpkins and do you know what happened right as I finished watering the last one? Rain. <laughs> oh, I would be upset. Let's hang. See, it says let's go see your house. Okay, so we're going to hang out with Donald. Let's say, hello, Donald. Hiya, Dot. Say, who do you think's the best entertainer? Mickey or me? Definitely you, Donald. Oh boy, oh boy. Thanks, Dot. Okay, let's see if we have something to give him. I think he's level nine, so we're real close. That's what happens when I get distracted. I was on point with this one. We were on our way. Uh, 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 uh. When I changed time on my switch, suddenly my iron nodes weren't spawning anymore. It was so bad. My towel was so... Oh, no. You had to start all the way over because of the time change. Oh. Kristoff will be asleep till 2 a.m. 2 a.m. That's that's absolutely fantastic. Love that. Love that for us. I, I really do. All right. Let's go find this green passion lily. It's over here. I'm so sorry, TJ. I know that what you I'm especially since you redecorated and stuff too. Oh, I'd have been upset. Suburban, you're back. Wonderful. Wonderful. I can't wait to redecorate. All right, we're watering. We're watering. Hold on a minute. I just noticed something. Where the heck is Pua? Pua wasn't next to me like the entire time. It's okay, I enjoy doing the quest the second time. Yeah, this game definitely has replayability for sure. Like, I would I would play all over again. I 
have something to give you. Here, take this green passion lily. <gasps> He's so close to level 10, guys. We're going to get a level 10 quest for Donald. Have something to give you. Um, How about a fish for all your troubles? Okay, that didn't do it. That didn't do it. Sad about all the lost items, though. Yeah, because that's the thing. Like, especially all the items from Scrooge's store. Ugh. I have something to give you. Let's go another flower. Perfect. There we go. Level 10. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Thanks. All right. So we've got his sailor's coat. <laughs> Hey, Dot, I know how we can finish my special project. Do you have time to help me? Sure, how can I help? Well, I was marching around the Sunlit Plateau, keeping an eye out for any sign of trouble. That's awfully brave of you. You're always... Oh, I hit the button too quick. You're always looking out for ways to help the village. It's inspiring. Well, I'm very inspirational. Ha 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 ha. Planet, hello, welcome in. So good to see you. Just getting home and happy to catch the last half. Yes! We still have plenty of time to hang out together. I seriously wanted uh, Wally's level 10 item, but it's not available in game. I know, I was sad about that. Mm. Yeah, we are on the way to maxing everybody out. The only person I don't think we'll be able to max out is Prince Eric. Donald's sailor suit is legit my favorite clothing item in the game. My character looks like a little prince looking dude. Cool. I'm going to try it on as soon as we get it. So, what did you find in the Sunlit Plateau? I found an old campsite. I think it was one of Kristoff's and I made when we were on... Wait, I think it was the one Kristoff and I made when we were on our quest to save the village from the forgetting. I remember I hid something very important there. Let's follow together and we can search for it together. Oh, Heather, thank you so much. You're awesome. Back at you. I appreciate you guys so much. Y'all are too kind. Well, I watched the first movie. Hopefully it wasn't... He isn't as bad in the game because there's hyenas. I'm going to be running away. Yeah, let's leave the... The hyenas don't have to come. Donna, where are you... Where are you look at this run. What's happening right now? <laughs> Donald. Donald said, I got to, I got to kick it into high gear. Oh, boy, oh, boy. I know. They're working on adding the mini dress in the game, right? I can't wait until we can save our outfits. Ooh, I know. Like, have outs uh, is it like outfit presets? Donald said, baby, come on over here. I got to show you something. It's past my bedtime. <laughs> Yo, his neck is literally grazing the ground as he runs. I, I just can't. Oh, Lisa, don't worry about it. It's okay. All right, good to see you. Um, sir, we came here together. What are you talking about? Okay, where's this quest at? Search the, uh, the campsite. Okay, so it's got to be this little letter here. Okay, Donald, I found a note. This was the campsite the whole time. But I'm glad, because if we're about to complete this quest, then I can then steal this campsite and put it at my house, which I really want to do. <laughs> hey, Donald, check this out. Huh? What's this? It's a note from me! I mean, me in the past. Even before the forgetting, I left myself notes so I'd always remember things uh that's a good habit yeah i've got tons of them come on let's read the note and see what i wanted to be sure i'd remember it's a reminder that i was planning to build something in the forgotten lands why would you build something in that awful place that place could sure you let's not let's not make a mad y'all <laughs> yeah i care if they're adding the feature but i'd love to be able to save outfits and put together yes i would love that too Instead of continuing to put the same outfit together once you change. It's definitely, this is definitely important to Donald. It's the neck grazing for me while he's running, y'all. That's all I'm saying. That's just what I thought. Hey, I wonder if it was something in that fountain we found the pieces for. 
I remember now. Yeah. I was planning to build a dream light fountain. That sounds amazing. So how do we finish it? We have to find the rest of my instructions. My note says there's another campsite in the Forgotten Lands near the ruins. That must be where you were planning to build the fountain. It says I buried the instructions for how to make the fountain there. Um, you lead the way, Dot. It's not that I'm scared of the Forgotten Lands, but, um, it's your turn to lead. Sure, Donald, we can do that. Phew. All right, then, follow me. Let's go search the Forgotten Lands. Oh, yes, that's right, Lisa. It's, yeah, 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 that is correct. Thank you so much for that reminder, Santa. I forgot myself. Um, I had to disable the links being able to put in the chat because um, spammers were coming in and just spamming the chat. It was Claire, but I don't think Claire's in the chat today. Hoagie, welcome in. Can you please help me out with getting Iron Agus? These quests require so much of it. Okay, Hoagie, two things. Go to, um, if you don't have them unlocked, you're going to need to unlock the... Um, glade of trust and you're going to want to mine in the forest of valor and you could probably get some iron too in the sunlit plateau but uh forest of valor and the glade of trust has the most iron in my opinion and you want to make sure you have your mining buddy with you so you can get double the iron when you're mining that's the best that you can do how do you unlock donald i think that's uh you level up your relationship with goofy i think goofy unlocks donald right y'all Yes, and the chat has all of the answers as well. Thank you guys so much for that. Yes, don't forget your mining buddy. You're going to miss out doubling up on some iron. Okay, so find the second campsite. Oh, these are both Donald's campsites. That makes sense. All right, here it is. Lisa, if you drop the link, if you send the link to me on Instagram, I can copy and paste it in the chat. Shoot the DM the link on uh, Instagram to me if you can. Okay, dig around the campsite to find the instructions. I think that's right here. Okay, what is it? It's a memory, okay. Oh, you're working on the Elsa quest for the three wind chimes or the Anna quest? Okay, so we have all of the picture completed. Okay, I remember all of this. And there's the well in the corner. Okay, we've got the memory. Let's talk to Donald. We did it. We found the instructions for building the Dreamlight Fountain. That is going to make the Forgotten Lands look so nice. Yeah, once we're done with it, it'll be the nicest place in the village. I don't know about that one, y'all. What do we have to do to build this thing oh no because we've already got so many resources that we need we need to get everything i wrote down here stones iron agate soil hardwood and clay oh my lord we are backlogged on clay and stone and everything plus all the parts of the fountain that i buried before here take the water pump basins turbine and distributors oh that's some technical stuff <laughs> When you have everything else, craft the Dreamlight Fountain and meet me back in the Forgotten Lands. I've got more planning to do. Y'all, this is not good. Well, at least it's not a ton. At least it's not a ton. Oh, Lisa, you sent it? Okay, perfect. I'm going to check it right now. I got it. Okay. Copy. All right, y'all, I'm, I'm pasting the link that Lisa wanted to share with you guys in the chat right there. Thank you, Lisa. Just finished planting 450 pumpkins. Woo-wee. That's some money right there. Food's here, so I got to go. I really enjoyed watching your live stream, seeing your adventures in Dreamlight Valley and chatting in as well. Oh, I thank you so much for coming, Suburban. Enjoy your food and have a great night. I'm so glad that you could join and hang out for a little while. I'm deciding between getting off or giving Eric flowers to get him to level 10 and do his quest. Cameron, go ahead and level Eric up. Go ahead and spam them flowers. 
grind it out. Tin clay, why so reasonable? Unlike Minnie Mouse. Yeah, I have I have to do right now, I have Minnie's quest, which requires a hundred stone, a hundred hardwood, iron igots, thirty of those, and two hundred clay. And now I have the additional resources that we need for Donald Duck. So it's just fantastic. All for a time clock. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Okay, so what we need to do is, Donald is fishing. So let's go find a mining buddy because we're gonna do some mining and some digging. But while he's here, let's fish up this fishing spot right here. Get another one of those ugly fish. Guys, if you're enjoying the stream, please don't forget to hit that thumbs up button so more people can come hang out with us. It would be amazing. And thank you so much for everybody who already gave the stream a thumbs up. I really appreciate you guys. We're sitting at 56 likes, so we're doing really well so far. Thank you, guys. All right, I'm just going to pick up some of these sticks, too, because we're never going to have enough sticks at this point. TJ, you just had a crash? Oh, no. Y'all, I hear um, Maui's big behind over here somewhere. Jazz, the foxes eat white sturgeon or salmon, which you can fish out of the frosted heights. And then all you need to do is chase them around. So they're gonna stop in front of you and then they're gonna run away. So just follow them to wherever they run away and just keep following them until you get the ability to approach them. Ooh, some dark wood. Dark wood is even more rare. There's rarely ever any dark wood. Okay, so y'all know it's gonna be, it's grinding it out time. It's grinding it out time. Oh, there's one thing I wanted to do, too. I need to... Oh, well, actually, let me check one other thing. Teddy, my favorite character in the game is definitely Wally. He's my absolute hands-down favorite. I, this game is, like, partially made because of him. He is absolutely amazing. I love Wally so much. He literally warms my heart. When do the sticks come in handy? I have like 200. Keep them all. They later in the in the game with the quest, you're going to need all those sticks. This is so random, but Katrina, I can see you doing a podcast. Really, Deanna? I've thought about doing a podcast. They say podcasts are like the new thing, like up and coming, like everybody should have a podcast. Stop hoarding your inventory. <laughs> We're going to go drop everything now. Hello, so glad to get here and share the good news. Thanks to your live. I now have Wally, Moana, Maui, and Anna working on getting Elsa. The bad news is I have multiple quests needing sticks or etc. Ah, I'm so happy for you, Debbie. Congratulations on all the new Valley members. You've been grinding it out. But I'm just like you. We Look, we can do it together because I'm about to work on sticks or and all of that. So let's find Maui. And try to get his relationship up to level 10. Yeah. Should we do Maui? Eric? Oh, we should do Mickey Mouse. Because he got that fountain. Okay, let's go find Mickey. I want to do Mickey. Oh! Speaking of Maui, when the hell did he get there? <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> NZ! Welcome back! I just imagine Scar's quest is going to be so tedious and require all the iron and the wood. He would just do it to make us miserable, wouldn't he? Wouldn't he? Y'all think I'd be an awesome podcaster? Oh, thanks so much. Is it my voice? <laughs> what would I talk about? I don't know. I always be talking, so I don't think talking is the problem. <laughs> Should I do Moana or Maui after I get Prince Eric to level 7? Do Moana. Well, Mary, it depends. My favorite is Moana's dress. So if you like that dress, then I would definitely say Moana. Hello, I don't know if it's true, but certain trees give certain types of wood. Once you find out, you can place that type of tree to get more wood. I heard that you could... I don't, I don't know. I've never heard about placing it, but that's possible. 
I heard that if you like remove a bunch of trees and leave like four trees, you'll still get the same amount of wood. I was washing dishes laughing so hard when Eric was in your pocket. <laughs> oh, Ashley, that was legit the funniest. That was probably the most I've ever laughed in a game ever. That was absolutely hilarious. Okay, so let's see. We've got a bunch of fish. I'm going to go ahead and put some of this fish away, except for the sole, because I know that Maui needs that. So let's put all our fish in here, the seaweed, salmon. Actually, the salmon needs to go to the Frosted Heights. I'll take that back. Thank you. We got some grass. Put that away. Oh, thanks, guys. That was hilarious. Kyle, you're about to get blocked out of the chat. Stop commenting that, please. Just so you know, you're about to get blocked. All right. Bye, Kyle. <laughs> Bye bye. Bye. Everybody say bye to Kyle. <laughs> like, why? Why are we doing that? <laughs> Not bye, Felicia. <laughs> like, what's the point? Why are we doing Why? 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 Wow. <laughs> uh, uh, I don't like it. I don't like it at all. Anyways. All right, so we're going to add the sticks in here. Oh, I got a piece of coal too. Look, Grace, we're, we are we are adding in. Are we getting all of our space back? Look at us. Let's see what we got in here. Metal spike fence. Wow. <laughs> Seems aggressive. I know that's so weird. Why are we doing that? I don't even think, I think that was like a real person, like not even like spam, but I, I don't understand. It's, you know what? It's fine. It's fine. Okay, so we need lots of stone. So let's just go ahead and pull out all of the stone. Um, let's see how much clay we have too. Where's the clay? It's over here. We do not have enough clay, y'all. We do not have enough clay. Uh, we need soil. Oh, so we'll add the soil back. And then we need iron ingots. And we have no iron. <laughs> oh my gosh, we're gonna have to grind it out, y'all. I know, Libby. What are we doing? Not, not us, but not you. Not about to ruin the vibe in here, babes. <laughs> Not at all. <laughs> oh, Ashley, the wall with flowers is a wall. Uh, it's a decoration that I got from Scrooge. Uh, I bought it in a store and then I put it in my inventory and bought a couple more. By the way, I want to check to make sure. I think I have that wallpaper. Let me see something. Scrooge was selling a wallpaper that I think I already bought. Oh, yeah, this one. This wallpaper is so pretty to me. I also bought this one. Ooh, this one's kind of cool. It's kind of like modern, you know? I kind of like that. There's Mickey's wall. So we definitely got a couple more options. I think my favorite is this black wall. But I know every wall can't be black, so. The blue was nice, right? Yeah, iron iron is tough, y'all. Iron is tough. Yeah, you can buy wallpapers from uh, Scrooge, Space Cat. When he's selling them, you can definitely buy them. There are so many pretty items. Oh, you love the sofa, Carly? I know, I love it too. I saw it in Scrooge store. I said, I gotta have it. <laughs> that's my vibe. So when you see something like this hanging, that's a wallpaper that you can buy for your house. I hope we can send gifts to people in the future. Me too. That would be so cool. Time to make some money. Time to make some money. <laughs> Not from me, Scrooge. <laughs> you already got my money for the day, baby. 
You already got my money for the day, sweetheart. I know, I just I just have to push him because it's just like Maui, why are you there? <laughs> why? Why? I actually really enjoy decorating the house. Actually, speaking of, we got the money. We need to upgrade our house. What are we doing? Okay, now's the opportune time to improve your house. More rooms, more floors. Hey, it'll be right impressive sight indeed. 75. Oh boy. I guess we're doing it, guys. 75,000. <gasps> Look at our home! I hope that they add an update too where you can decorate maybe the outside of your home. Like change how it looks on the outside. But look at this house. Oh my gosh, we've got a fully upgraded house. Yeah, we balling for real for real now, y'all. Okay, so we can add another room. Let's add a room. We're just gonna do, let's do it eight by eight. And this is going to be the bedroom, our guest bedroom. We got the money and we about to have more pumpkins so we gonna have plenty of money. <laughs> Ooh, floors, <gasps> add a floor. Definitely adding a floor, yes please. Okay, I didn't need that, but I wanted it. That's the problem when you have money. You buy things you don't need. <laughs> oh, wow. The door was perfectly placed right here. Wonderful. House looking good. Yeah, we big balling now. Big balling now. There's a total of 20 floors. What? That's kind of insane. All right, I wanted to get this extra room because... Ooh, this rug is actually really nice. Okay. That rug's kind of nice too. Okay, I have this extra bed that I want to put down. Uh, let's go to bed. This one. Isn't that nice? It's a nice little bed. I thought that was really cute. So we have that bed. Do we have any any tables? We've got one wooden side end table. We can put that there. Um, tables. No, don't need any of that. Storage. Could have put a dresser in here. We don't have any good dressers. I mean, there's this one. I guess we could put that there for right now. But yeah, I just wanted to put that down because I thought that was nice. Ooh, there's a little jewelry stand that we could put right here too. But isn't that a cute bed? I had no idea that we could have 20 floors. So it's just a start, but I feel like this could be like a cute little children's room. <laughs> Pinky room, oh yeah. This could be like a crazy room. Like I have a, let me see something. Whoa. That, that's insane looking. Ooh, I like this simple blue wall. That looks like a prison. I just want to leave it like this for right now just because <laughs> oh my gosh this is this is insane this is too much this is too much need a boom boom room <laughs> Aaron you have your entire house upgraded that's because you got that money you got that pumpkin money wow this is vibrant is that supposed to be cheese? I love the chaos. Just make it as chaotic as possible. <laughs> Sugar rush room. That's exactly that's exactly what it reminds me of. All right, so who do we need to... Let, let's go get Scrooge because he's the best mining buddy we've got. Let's go get this iron because y'all know. Esther, congratulations on Ariel. <laughs> Very nice. Let's hang out, please, sir. Thank you so much. Honey from Pooh Bear. No, literally, that's exactly what that looks like. It looks like honey, right? I've got your back. Maui, Maui, get off the stairs. Get off the stairs. Go away. 
Go away. Let's go this way. Yep, yep, good for you. Good for you. Over here. Oh my goodness. That man is always on the stairs. Why? I hope Why? Max is doing okay with All right, let's go up to the Forest of Valor first. I'm gonna finish the quest this weekend. Nice, Stacy. Stacy, I don't know if I said hello, but welcome in. Sorry about that. You have a thorn slash hero room? Ooh, Heather, that's a good idea. Libby, you have a hundred you have a hundred K Dreamlight? What? Nice, real nice. I feel like I saw you comment earlier, Stacey. I just forgot to say hello. But hello, hello. Yeah, you know what's funny? I hate to say this, but I haven't... I don't think I've seen the Wreck-It Ralph movies either. So I need to do that as well. Aaron, you're just shy of 80k Dreamlight? Oh my gosh, I am nowhere close to that amount of Dreamlight. I really need to focus on cooking. I just haven't yet. <laughs> But I know cooking would give me a lot of dream light. These night thorns, you know, you think that once you remove them, they'd stop coming back. But I guess they won't until we figure out what's going on with uh, Dreamlight Valley, right? Ooh, okay, lots of sticks. Good. There's some hard wood there. Yeah, these actually, these stumps, removing these stumps is good for uh, getting hard wood, I think. The Wreck-It Ralph movies are cute. Okay, I need to watch them. I don't know why I haven't seen those, honestly. I have no idea why I haven't seen those. You know what we didn't do, y'all? We didn't check Kristoff's stand. We got to check that man's stand. Please tell me you've seen Big Hero 6. Uh-oh. I have it. I'm sorry. Uh-oh, the canola is popping up. You know what, too? I'm going to... Oops. That's not what I wanted to do. I'm going to plant some of those pumpkins here, too. Might as well use the open space. If you're a millennial that grew up with gaming, you'll love them. Okay, cool. I'm definitely going to watch. I feel like I might have seen some of it, but I just never watched it. All the way. I know, Chantel. I'm sorry. Okay, I got to check that one out, too. Wait, how do we eventually remove the stumps? So through your quest lines um, and improving relationships, you, um, I think it's Maui. With Maui, you'll get um, the ability to, no, it's not Maui. Who is it? One of the Valley members helps you up, uh, upgrade your, your shovel. And then you can remove the stumps. All right, I'm just gonna, uh, I don't wanna do this, but Pumpkins are the most important thing, so I'm just going to harvest the rest of these onions out of the way. Oh, it's Anna. Anna. Okay. Good, good, good. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Y'all know my memory, baby. That is, it's a struggle bus in this brain of mine. <laughs> Hands of Violet. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I appreciate it. I just one, did one round to get the work from the four trees in each biome. I got 34 hard, 70 soft, 20 dry, 8 dark, and I can't gather again until about 20 minutes. That's actually really good. Lisa, do you have your tree set up where it's just like four trees? Maui is the coral. That's right, Libby. That is right. Ugh, Mother Gothel was here. Oh, gosh. What does she want? What is she even doing here? I swear, Mother Gothel was just always behind. Look at her. Girl, didn't nobody ask you to come over here and talk to us. Didn't nobody ask you to come over here. Now you got a wet dress. Look at you. Now you got a wet dress. See? I told you to mind your business, Mother Gothel. I told you you got in the way of my garden, and now you got a wet dress. <laughs> oh, you just going to step on my plants? Oh, all right. Okay. All right. I see what type of time you on, Mother Gothel. 
Yep. It's all, a lot of the quests come through like increasing relationships with the valley members. <laughs> Have you dying every time you see Mother Gospel or Kristoff? They just, ooh. You know what I'm saying? They just, ooh. Like, what is y'all doing here? Huh? Huh? And Mother Gothel always got some, you look tired, dear. Stay out of the sunlight. It's not good for the complexion. Blah, blah, blah. She always got something slick to say. Gothel's bad room. She just needs a timeout. No, but for real, though. You wonder why they added her in the Tangled Princess? I think they probably added her first because they needed more, like, villainous characters in the game, if villainous is a word. I feel like that's probably why. I'm so used to chatting, I sometimes want to like your comments by tapping two times. I swear I was so close to accidentally <laughs> blocking everyone at least once. <laughs> Oh, it would be cool if you could like comments in uh, live chat, though. That would actually be awesome. It's a really good idea. Somebody need to pitch that over to YouTube. If you're watching, give us the ability to, to like comments in a live chat. Um, are there any more of those stumps around here? No. You know, I wish that you could get iron ore from breaking down some of the rocks, too. All right, let's travel over to the Glade of Trust. And see if we can get some, too. Gothel's very rude, considering we let her live on our valley for free. I'm saying, buttered roll. That's what I'm saying. Like, you don't even pay rent here. You get to live in the valley for free, enjoy your time. Nobody bothers you, and yet here you are always dogging us out about everything. What's the problem? <laughs> What's the problem, sweetie? <laughs> oh, I miss uh, Wally saying Eve's name, but I've heard it before. It is the cutest. I love it so much. Yeah, I know she's got very expensive taste, but what would you? What else would you expect from Mother Gotham? Okay, what else would you expect from that woman? Of course she has expensive taste. Uh-oh, our energy's low. That's because we're putting in this work out here. Let's get us some lobster. Nah, I ain't slaving to make her sushi so she can be rude. <laughs> Wally's my favorite too. I'll literally give Wally anything he ever asked for. Whatever he wants, he gets it. Oh! Oh, yes. Wow, that is the perfect time for this event to happen. Dang, I think I just got all of those. Did they fix the timey, timed event? I'm actually kind of shocked. Heather, your game crashed. Oh, no! Uh, we've had a couple of crashes tonight, huh? Scrooge, any day now you could expand on some of this iron my friend. I would expect you to know what it's called before requesting us to make it, right? <laughs> Uh-oh. Scrooge always gets glitched out at this rock here. I don't know what that is. That's happened twice now in my game. I gotta rewatch Wally after playing this game. This game made me really like him. He's too cute. I know. I wanna rewatch it again, too. I wanna rewatch him again, too. I want some Wally merchandise, you know? I need some Wally things. Once I can uh, start, like, really setting up the game room, you know, and my, like, setup and everything, I would love to have, like, a little Wally character in here. He's so cute. Hang him on a little shelf or something. <laughs> screwed you out right there he's literally like uh, uh, i'm stuck i can't move oh there he is okay i'm glad to see you found your way out there not my not my damn inventory we should probably do the iron should we just finish the dreamlight yeah we should we should finish the dreamlight uh fountain for donald first let's see how many 
Yes, it's raining. Perfect. Just in time for all my sweet little pumpkins to stay watered. I rewatched Wally last weekend and it's so much better than I remembered. It's going to be so much better because of this game. I feel like we have a new, like everybody loved Wally before, but now we have like a newfound relationship with the kid. Okay, how many can we make? Okay, we can't make any because we have no storage space. What's in our inventory? Well, it's because I got all this miscellaneous stuff in here. Who put that in my inventory? Grace is about to get me. <laughs> is it Funko's? Am I pronouncing that right? I don't buy a lot either, but I've always wanted to collect something because I, like, I don't have anything that I actually collect. So I feel like I want to collect some of those. At least for some of my favorites. Yeah, Teddy, you're right. There is one with him holding his plant. I saw it on Amazon, so I'm like, I gotta get, I gotta get one of those. Too cute. Too cute. Buttered roll. I'm about to get a Wally tattoo. No, but for real though, you might be onto something. <laughs> you might be onto something with a Wally tattoo. That would actually be fire. If you trust somebody to do it right, that would actually be so cute. Like maybe even a line art Wally. Ooh. Or you could just get Wally's boot tatted. <gasps> I might actually get that tatted on me somewhere. Oh boy. Honestly, it would be a tribute to the channel because because of you guys. Like my channel has really taken off playing this game. And so I feel like I should get that tatted. Maybe I'll do it for my birthday. Should I get should I get a Wally tattoo, y'all? Oh my gosh. Should I? Buttered roll. Should we get should we get tattoos? Should we get a Wally tattoo? I don't know if you guys know that, but like I, I'm into tattoos. I'm not like tatted. My husband's pretty tatted, but I um I have a tattoo on my back and I also have a tattoo on my ankle. Maybe I could post a picture so you guys can see. But I, I wanted like a really something like small, like another cute little tattoo somewhere, maybe like on the ribs. And we could do a Wally tat. Oh my God, I'm, I'm actually really into it. Y'all, we should get the Wally boot with the little plant coming out of it. Oh my gosh. I have Star Wars half sleeves. Nice. Barzy says get the tat. Yes, we got to get tatted. Oh, my God. Okay, I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. That would be so good. Oh, a Star Wars sleeve is probably fire, Mimi. I bet that looks so good. Oh, Planet, thank you so much for the donation. To the funniest Dreamlight Valley streamer ever, thanks for providing entertainment and a fun community. Oh. Thank you for being a part of the community and for always hanging out. I love you guys so much. Thank you so much. Okay, so now we can craft the fountain. Yay! Planet, that was just to the coffee fun. Now I can get another coffee. So excited. This weekend I plan on trying the spice chai. Okay, so let's see. Where is this fountain? <gasps> Y'all, we're going to have to find a cool place to put this fountain too. I just saw Remy almost scream. You know what, though? I'm not going to lie. When Remy comes, like, running through, I, it actually terrifies me. I'm like, what the hell is that running through the grass? Let's do it. We're doing it. It's happening. I've made my mind up. I'm getting that tatted somewhere just because it's... It is, it's actually a bench, literally a benchmark for me. Like this is, has been the most growth I've seen in my channel since I've started. And, um, it's really like a tribute to show that like I'm doing the right thing. I'm doing something that I enjoy and something that other people enjoy. And that makes me super happy. So we're doing it. Of course I'll keep you updated, but yeah, maybe I'll get that. I think I'll do that for my birthday. My birthday is December 6th. So Soon, soon, soon. Yes, it was so nice, Planet. Thank you so much. 
I love that you love Dreamlight Valley as much as me. I watched a streamer hating on it lately, and it was the worst. Oh, no. We don't want that kind of negativity in our lives. Absolutely not. <laughs> I mean, to each his own, but <laughs> nah, baby. We can't have that kind of negativity in our life. I just don't understand how you could hate the game, but you know, that's just my personal opinion. Inventory is always full no matter what. No, really, though. It's now a tattoo fund. <laughs> We funded a tattoo. Could you imagine? <laughs> oh my God, that's so good. Coffee fund about to turn into the Wally Tat fund. It could go back to the coffee fund after, but it's definitely a Wally Tat fund right now. <laughs> Layla, greetings from the Caribbeans, K and chat. Welcome. Oh my gosh, the Caribbean. I love that. All right, what are we doing? We need to meet Donald in the Forgotten Lands. Okay, so we need to go back up to the Forgotten Lands because it's time to place this fountain. Layla, welcome back. I'm pretty sure I remember you were in another stream. Ashley, are y'all just selling the pumpkins or cooking them and then selling them? Ashley, I'm not going to lie to you. If you cook and sell the pumpkins and you make those pumpkin puffs, you can make a ton of money, but it takes forever. What? I thought there were two of these people. I thought there was two Donalds out here for a second. Not y'all looking exactly the same. All right. Yes, let's get Wally Tats. It's happening. I'm getting a Wally Tat. If anybody wants to join in on this <laughs> endeavor, by all means. She was like forcing herself to play it and then she clearly didn't like it and I was like, oh no. See, that's something I will never do. One thing y'all will never see me do is play a game or stream a game that I don't enjoy. Like, I may play it if it's new, but if I don't like it, I end up not liking it, that's it. I'm not going to play it again. Because it's just not enjoyable to sit on stream playing something that you don't like. Mad Max, your birthday's December 6th? Well, that explains it. That explains it. Uh, there's Gothel again. <gasps> Steph, thank you so much. Okay, the tattoo fun. We're going... <laughs> We are going up. Oh my gosh. I gotta, you know what? I gotta figure out a like a good design. You know, what art style are we gonna go with? <gasps> I'm so excited about this. Thank you so much for the donation, Steph. Thank you, thank you, thank you. We serious about this tattoo. It's happening. We might have to do it earlier than my birthday. It made me end up not liking the streamer, but you're absolutely awesome. Thank you, Teddy. Okay, let's give him this fountain. Okay, we got some Sagittarius's in the chat. Emin, hello. Hi, I'm a new subscriber, but I've just been lurking, but I love your streams. I just bought a Switch this month, and this is the best game to start out with. Oh my gosh, yes, this is definitely a great game to start out with. And thank you so much for subscribing. Welcome to the family. I'm so happy that you're here. That's awesome. Everybody, welcome Emin in. Hello, hello. The adorable Wally is seen feeding a pumpkin to the ravens in the... I know! I thought that was so cute. Hey, Ariel, welcome back. I thought that was so cute. I said, not Wally, just in the back being cute. Check out New School Tats. Okay, I'll definitely take a look into New School Tats then. Is it, def is it a type of art style? Oh, yeah. Uh, Steph, my birthday is December 6th. <gasps> Tiffany, December 2nd. Look at y'all. Sagittarius says. I love to see it. Yes, Grace. He was holding a pumpkin in the sky and there were ravens flying over him. So it looked like he was definitely feeding a raven. <gasps> maybe that's a hint. Maybe raven's favorite food is pumpkins. And maybe ravens are going to be the critter that's in the forgotten lands. <gasps> what? I'm an Aquarius, January 31st. Nice. My brother's an Aquarius. Momo, I just subscribed based on this stream alone. I already love you and your channel. You're so positive, and I hope you never lose that. And yes, tattoo fun. Let's go. Momo, welcome to the family. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Thank you so much for joining the family. I'm so happy that you're here. Oh, my God. I can't wait to get this tattoo and post a picture. I got to find a good artist, though. Can't, they can't mess this one up. 
You can't mess the Wally tattoo up. It's going to be a problem. Okay, I built a dreamlike fountain just like you asked. Oh boy, it's all coming together. I'll go set it up in the Forgotten Lands. I picked the perfect spot. Sure, here you go. Oh, so he's going to put it in a spot. Okay, Virgo in September, Scorpio, Gemini. Oh, December, yes, birthday at the beginning of the month, the Christmas near the end, I know. It's the best thing about having a December birthday. Mimi, thank you so much for the donation. You're so delightful, love how tickled you get. Oh, y'all make, make me tickled, okay? I can't help it. I get so excited to hang out with you guys. June 23rd, I'm a Cancer, beautiful. June. Yeah, my son's birthday is in June. Do you feel the pressure now about finding the right tattoo artist? I do. I feel that pressure heavy. Because you can't just trust anybody to do your tattoos. Somebody got to be talented. Hey, I've got another great idea. Let's invite some friends to celebrate all our hard work. The question is, where should we put the tattoo? Put this ribbon near the fountain so it'll look great for the big celebration. Oh, we're going to bring everybody to the fountain. Bye bye, be good. Oh no. Donald, this is a <laughs> Donald, this is a terrible spot. Your daughter's birthday is December 19th. Oh. It's coming up. December's coming up. Scorpio, October 23rd. We got Gemini, Taurus, Capricorn. Come on now. I love it. June 16th, we got another Virgo. Gemini, May 25th. Come on, Esta. My birthday was this past Tuesday, October 11th, a.k.a. Team Libra. Oh, happy belated birthday. How was your birthday? Did you have fun? <gasps> Behind the ear, Deanna. <gasps> oh, my gosh. Yes, I'm thinking small and dainty. I am. I like behind the ear. I'm not mad at that. Sagittarius, baby. Okay, Gracie, Grace, that's, you know, that's why we get along. <laughs> okay, so we need to put this ribbon down, but let me tell y'all something. Go uh, not Goofy. Donald really chose the worst spot. Like, why? Why? Why right there? Huh? It's some ugly stuff all around this area. I need all of that to get out the way. Okay, this is better. I can work with this. Just don't get a face tattoo. <laughs> Are you sure? You know, a little Wally right on the cheek. I mean, who could deny me a job or anything if I had that on my face? Honestly, if you deny me a job when I have Wally tattooed on my face, it's literally just because you're a hater. <laughs> it's obvious. Okay, so we need to move all this stuff. All this stuff's got to go, excuse me. Ah, TJ, you're a Leo, June 30th. I love Leos. Gas to rep for the Leos. Don't, don't be like Mike Tyson. <laughs> it was my day off from work, so got to relax and end the day with dinner at Bonefish. Ooh, nice. You had the day off too? That's a beautiful thing. Bonefish is really delicious, actually. Oh, my gosh. There's so much stuff in the way. Hello? Oh, my controller. <laughs> okay, let's move that there. Okay, we should have spit. He said put it behind the fountain, but which side is behind? Let's put it. Oh, finally, we actually. I was going to say, finally, we actually get a good picture. Okay, okay, all right. Yes, we do. Kind of. Okay, we're going to do it this way because that fountain is legit. And it's raining. Like, this is going to be a terrible fixture. <laughs> I don't know. All right, y'all just, everybody who can get in, get in. Uh, there we go. That's the best we could do. <laughs> this is a terrible picture. Here representing us, Aries gang. Come on, Aries. Hello, hello. I love how we have so many different um, signs in it. Is it signs? Horoscopes? 
Not horoscopes. <laughs> what? Leo's and Sag get along. That's probably why we're so into the stream. Yes. Stacy, well, have a good night. Have to get some sleep. Stacy, get some good rest. Thank you so much for hanging out. I hope you have a wonderful night. Get some of that good sleep. Get some sleep for me. <laughs> Heather, you just erase your entire sidewalk. You know I do that so I do that so often. <gasps> yes, the bang bang shrimp are so good from there. I remember the bang bang shrimp. Donald! Donald! Donald, wait! <laughs> <laughs> Donald, wait. Donald, we have to talk. Excuse me. Donald, hey, slow down. Take a second, please. The Forgotten Lands look so much better now. Thanks for your help, Dot. I'm not going to lie to you, Donald. That, that um, water fountain is getting moved. <laughs> that water fountain. Ronald, please don't what? Get in lit in the rain. <laughs> Okay, so, um, thanks for your help. No, thank you, Donald. Oh, it was my pleasure. Mine, too. Since I'm such a great friend, I got you a present to thank you for being such a great friend, too, Dot. We got the shirt. We got TJ's favorite shirt. Oh, it's actually cute. I do like it. This is actually cute. Is there a full outfit for this? I wonder. Does anyone know where the crafting recipes Prince Eric gives you goes? Um, are they the... Oh, we have sailor shorts? Okay, let's hang out because I need to get you to level 10. Oh, this is a great time. We gotta get to the... We gotta get to the Glade to Trust because this is the perfect time to get clay. Oh, Steph, thanks for the tip. Okay, where is... It is storming out here. We actually need... Uh, unfortunately, we gotta get Mother Gothel, y'all. Top would look super cute with a skirt. Yes, it would, actually. Yes, it would. Let's hang out, girl. We're gonna go digging. Your favorite. <laughs> Okay, so let's dig right here, because this always looks like clay to me. Hello? Okay, you know what? Alright, let's actually... We should dig by the water, right? Because you guys say that's where you get a lot of clay. <gasps> Chantel! Yes, 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 yes! Thank you so much for the reminder. Because we need to improve our relationship with Minnie, too. So let's get Minnie. Don't bring Gothel. Yeah, she's going to intentionally not give us clay anyway. So we got to go get Minnie. Oh my gosh. Thank you guys so much for the reminder. That was almost a big mistake. <laughs> not Gothel. Anybody but Gothel. Oh, girl, can you get out of the way? Goodbye. Goodbye. I'm getting out of here. Oh, there she is. Hello. Yeah, Gothel. Goodbye. Okay, so now that we've got mini, now we can go back to the Glades of Trust and try this again. Yeah, the chat is awesome. You guys stay on it. That's what I love. That's what I love. Y'all make sure I'm just on my P's and Q's. That reminds me of the friend episode. Do you know which one I'm talking about? I don't. Who told them I wanted all this clay? Because I don't. How do I get Scrooge to have... Um, cuter clothes in his shop i have his store all the way upgraded but when i order from him the clothes are ugly yeah i'm not gonna lie that's actually true i sometimes i just get like really really ugly things from scrooge's store i'm not gonna lie i but honestly i don't think there's anything you can do but just unfortunately like just wait until you know it gets better he gets better stuff i don't i don't think there's anything else you can do I hope one day we can get villager clothing items and they wear it around. Yes, just like Animal Crossing. That would be super cute. Did I just get three clay there? Ooh, 
Okay. I get all the ugly clothes. <laughs> Scrooge be skimping on the good stuff. That's why, like, there are certain days where I go into Scrooge's store and he's just got everything I could ever want in there. It's crazy. Oh, love you too, Heather. Thank you so much. Thanks for being here and hanging out with us. Okay, so I think I got... Okay, that was just one clay. I feel like I keep seeing three clay for some reason. Don't blame you. Scrooge has some cool stuff. He's the reason I'm broke in the game now. No, but for real, though. Y'all are awesome. Y'all are awesome. Oh my gosh, is anybody watching, um, I don't know if anybody is like TV show buffs and stuff like that, but are, is anybody watching the Ring of, Ring of Power, I think it is? It's like the, not the spinoff, I guess a spinoff, maybe, or a prequel or something to, um, Lord of the Rings. I don't know if anybody's a fan of those movies. I really like them. The mini patch pants are so cute. I don't think I have the mini patch pants yet. Okay, so Mad Max is behind three episodes, so if anybody is a fan, don't drop any spoilers right now. But I actually really enjoy that show. It's so good. It just keeps getting better. What streaming platform is it on? I've been watching it on... Um, it's a... Uh, 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 what is that? What is it called? Does anybody know? I can't remember. Prime. Yes. Okay. <laughs> yeah, it's actually so good. And the other one that I've really been enjoying is House of Dragons. Of course, if you love Game of Thrones, then you're probably obsessed with that. Look, any show that's got dragons in it, ta, you you can believe. <laughs> I'm obsessed with it. I just wish in real life that I could literally just have a dragon. Like, I just don't understand why I can't have a dragon. So it's really hard for me when I'm watching the show to not visualize like my real life. Cause in real life, like I want a dragon. <laughs> Good night, everyone turning in. Got to get up for work tomorrow. Hugs. Oh, hugs, Des. Thank you so much for stopping by. Donald. 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 Deep breaths. Deep breaths, Donald. <laughs> hey. Welcome in, Steph, to the chat. Hey, beauty. Just got off the game myself trying to grind everything out. That's literally what we're doing right now. Donald. Donald. We're trying to talk. We're all trying to have a very relaxing conversation right now, and you're losing it. You're losing your shit. Let's breathe together, huh? Let's say in and out. You see? Don't you feel more relaxed? What do you need? A bass, a fish, or something? What What do you need? What What do you need? Let's look here. Take a uh oh, take an apple. Take an apple. That should help. There you go. <laughs> Yes, House of Dragons is so incredibly good. Like, I was actually skeptical because I'm like, how can they follow up with Game of Thrones? But it's it's insanely good. And this, I don't, no spoilers. I'm not going to release any spoilers. But this last episode, y'all? <laughs> oh, my, oh, my. Does anybody know if this last episode was like the last, um... Okay, I got to get away from Donald. This man is having a conniption. But yeah, does anybody know if this was the last episode of the season? Because if it, if it is, I'm sick. I just bought 600 more pumpkins. Wish me luck. Oh, boy. <laughs> Good luck, TJ, because you already know. That's going to be a minute of gardening. <gasps> there will be 10 episodes? Oh, my gosh. Then I cannot. I literally cannot wait for next week. I can't wait. 
Oh yeah, I was I was literally no no spoilers, but at the dinner table, oh boy, oh boy. I was about I was about to lose it. I had to keep my composure. The next one is called the Green Council. Oh my. Oh, Teddy, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. That's I to be honest, I literally was like I had that same feeling like I just felt I'm so like I'm such an emotional person like I can totally envision and I know other people struggle with stuff like that and it was very realistic so I can only imagine dealing with that like in real life being kind of difficult to watch because it was hard it was hard for me to watch <laughs> and he's such a good guy but no spoilers remember no spoilers for anybody who hasn't seen it yet oh we only need a little bit more clay y'all it's been raining for a minute in the game too i planted 700 pumpkins my thumb huts hurts from holding down <laughs> oh my gosh we almost got 200 clay i can't believe it yeah if you can if you can bring emotion out of me like that then that's how you know it's it's a good it's a good movie or a good show just a good watch Steph, you're grinding it out in the game. It looks like everybody's grinding it out in the game tonight. Lisa, you got to exercise that thumb. Get some thumb some thumb circles going around. <laughs> Tech girl, Steph, have you? Um, how far are you on your questing? Sorry, I just say tech girl stuff because I know we got two Stephs in uh, the chat right now, so. Hey, look at this little guy. How did I, how did that happen? I don't know, but here's some lobster. We got the clay, we got the clay. I am so glad that y'all gave me the hint to collect clay early on. I'm not gonna lie to y'all, I might just leave these holes here for a couple days <laughs> and let it disappear on its own. But yeah, um, damn, I forgot what I was saying before that. I'm so excited. We get to craft up this clock tower now. So now, oh, I lied. Oh, I lied. Okay, you know what, Minnie? Oh, hello. All that digging we did and Minnie didn't level up. Okay. Uh, I have something to give you. Let's see if she has wants anything that's in my inventory. Gooseberry? Perfect. There you are. Same girl, LL, trying to get through this before the new update Wednesday. I know. Have to go to work now. Have a good stream and see you next time. Esther, thank you so much for coming as always. It's so nice to see you in the streams. I hope you have a great day at work. Jazz, I love how she remembers everyone that comes to the streams. Make me feel special. Y'all are special. Y'all are special to me. Y'all are special to me. I always say this, but I'm telling y'all, I could be alone here. So the fact that I'm not makes it very important to me to remember you guys. Plus, how can I not remember y'all? Y'all are hilarious. Y'all are hilarious. I haven't unlocked Eric or Anna and Elsa. I unlocked everyone else and got Wally to level 10 tonight. Ooh, okay, so you put in some work today. Oh, did you see that level 10 um, gift that you get from Wally? It's not in the game yet, but I want it so bad. It's that backpack that's coming. I want that backpack. Bad boy. Bad. Yes, agreed. So many helpful tips from these streams when I first started. Yes, I learned so much from you guys too. Even like the tip videos that I made, a lot of it was like I was only able to make them because a lot of you guys helped me out with a lot, so... Okay, so we have the clay. Let's see how much hardwood we have in the chest back here. Mika! Yes, love our thoughtful queen. Love you guys too. <laughs> you thought you were until dun dun. <laughs> iron, wonderful. We just love that we have iron that we still need. 30 iron at that. <laughs> yes, the alligators are like, I love them. They're one of my favorites. Anna, hello. First time joining your streams. Hello, hello. Welcome in. Thank you so much for hanging out with us tonight. I love you too, Libby. 
No one, no way someone as amazing you would ever be alone streaming. I'm just glad I'm not. Thank, I'm so thankful to y'all. Yes, it's so cute. Have you played any more Coral Island? Not yet, but I plan on playing Coral Island because I want to get a good, because uh, I'm at a pretty good place now, I think. But I want to get to a pretty good place um, with uh, questing and everything in Dreamlight Valley so that we're prepared for Wednesday night stream. Yes, make sure y'all put it on the calendar. We will be streaming. I might even do, if I can make it work, babysitter-wise, maybe my husband will be... He might not be working. I'll have to check with him. But maybe we could do like an early afternoon stream or a night stream. I'll let you guys maybe decide if I can work that out. But yes, I'd love to be streaming release day. So when the update comes in on Wednesday. But I'll play some Coral Island. That's a long explanation to say. I'll play some Coral Island on Monday. I'm so glad you came by. Also, if I can work it out, guys, I was thinking about maybe doing like a surprise pop stream which is not so much as a, a surprise on Sunday this week let me know if y'all would be interested in something like that I can check to see if um, my husband is um, isn't gonna be working Ronald you heard uh, Coral Island was good might check it out I really like Coral Island so there's a couple of things um, about it that definitely makes it still feel early access because I think it would be better played with a controller it's, oh, I thought Anna was at the house. I almost got excited. I think it would definitely be better played with a controller. Um, let's go get Scrooge because we need him for mining. And it also feels a little like a mobile app game because of the, like, your viewpoint is from up above your character. But it's a beautiful game and it's actually a lot of fun. And I just love exploring the world and all the characters. I think it's still a really well thought out game, so I like it. I would probably give it an 8 or 9 out of 10 right now. Let's mm -hmm. hang out, sir. Yes to early afternoon. Okay, yeah, I might try to work that out. Because I'm hoping that, like, I don't know when the update is actually going to drop. But if it does drop in time, then we could do an early afternoon stream maybe. And then maybe, again, we could stream later that night too. I'd probably still do two streams that day. Yes, once I leave the controller support, I'll be all over it too. Girl, same, I want that. I was disappointed it was not in the game yet. Me either. Mika, that would be so nice. You guys excited for that? Awesome. I haven't heard of Cult of the Lamb. I need to check that one out. I haven't heard that one. Mika, you said Cult of the Lamb is super fun. What's the, what's the premise of the game? What are we doing in there? I've never been so excited for an update until the Scar update. Oh, absolutely. I don't think I've ever been so... I haven't been this excited about a game. Look at all the stars. Um, outside of The Sims, I think. So it, like, brings me back to, like, nostalgic feelings of, like, really being excited about something like this. I've been playing Coral Island so much, it's a lot of fun. The only reason I put it down today was because of the pumpkin panic. You're like, I gotta get into the valley and get these pumpkins planted. <laughs> That's so funny. I watched Wally first time the other day since watching your channel and hearing saying how cute he is. He's adorable. He's the cutest thing ever with his little plant and pet. I know. That's what I like him holding up that little plant in the booth. It's just so it's so holistic. It's just so perfect. I'll be working Wednesday around 4, so I will hopefully catch you plus the update my game after that. Can't wait. Yes, 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 yes. And I'm, I might, it depends on how everything goes, but I might be playing again that night too at 9 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, so we'll see how it goes. Cult of the Lamb is so great. Oh, I need to, okay, y'all gonna make me download another game. By the way, I tried to pick the leader shard up again today, but it still can't pick it up. Oh, no. I would have thought they would have had that quest fixed by now. Maybe they're so like busy with the update that they can't fix it or haven't had time. Jamie, sorry, I've been feeling so sporadic from the stream today, just dealing with a lot of stuff emotionally. Was able to get Wally's gardens fake. I'm sorry you're dealing with a lot now. Sorry, I hope we weren't too overwhelming for you. But I hope everything gets better. But at least you got Wally's garden fixed. That's good. I haven't been this excited since the Animal Crossing 2.0 update, right? Definitely gives me sim happiness. Definitely. And you know there was, there's nothing like that sim happiness. 
Thanks for calling me Cranny. That's my actual nickname. Oh, I'm sorry. I've been calling you Planet Cranny. It is Cranny. I like it. We're going to need a lot of iron, y'all. It's really cutely done, but you plan a cult leader trying to recruit followers. You go on ventures and build up a community of worshipers. <gasps> oh, is it on Switch? And does it play good on Switch? Because I feel like that would be like the perfect little game to like just sit back and what a that's actually a really cool premise for a game. I've never heard of anything like that. Sounds dark, I'm in. <laughs> 80, welcome in. How are you? Howdy, howdy. Good to see you back. What you up to? I really enjoy the Sims games too. I was so excited to see Kay used to play them before I got caught onto her stream. Yes, we'll be doing some Sim streams too. We'll probably actually get into some more Sim streams after we complete the Scar update. If there's not a lot to do other than like decorating the valley after we get the update and we're waiting for another update, we might get back into some Sims. Some Sims and some Coral Island. Or who knows, they may release another game. I mean, goodness, they've been releasing games like crazy, right? Have y'all heard the Sims 5 maybe announce October 18th? I've been hearing the rumors. I've been hearing the rumors. See, I'm not going to get my hopes up because that's something that happens in the Sims community. We, like, obsess over an idea that is not confirmed and then be real let down. <laughs> All right, let's go over to, I think, the Forest of Valor, see if we can get some more hardwood. Of course, Cranny, of course. I told you iron is heavily leaded. It's so bad. I know, it sounds like the perfect Halloween game. Look, I might just take my son trick-or-treating, head on back, eat his candy since he can't have it, and just sit and play that game. <laughs> Stacy, welcome back. How are you? No worries. It's okay. Greetings, neighbor. I've been trying to play while watching, but I love interacting and keeping up with the chat. Oh, I know. I love it because we all get to, like, bye -bye we, like I said, we just get to kind of, like, hang out together and play together. Oh, guys, can I move this... Can I move this cooking station? Ooh, you would love a Sims stream. TJ, I was actually thinking about like some Sims 4 streams or Sims 3 streams, but if we did Sims 4 streams, we could play the scenarios, play out some of the scenarios, because that would be cool. Heather, going to bed. Good night, all. Thank you so much for hanging out, Heather. I hope to see you on another live stream. I am completing the last mini quest and it is taking some major grinding, 80, some major grinding. But you know, y'all don't mind me. I'm just gonna just gonna pop that into my inventory. We can leave the chairs right there. Yep, that's mine now. Oh boy, I've been I've been waiting on that. <laughs> I've been waiting on that grill, boys. We got it now. <laughs> we got it now. Oh yeah, this thing. I don't know, I don't know what Donald thought was going to happen, but that is getting moved from right there. It does not belong in this area. It's too pretty to be out here. Poor Donald. He's going to be like, did you really move my fountain? Is that what we're doing? Luigi Mansion is such a good Halloween game. Ooh. Hippie, hello, welcome back. How are you? Um, we can get iron here, right? Let's see if we can get some iron here. Good, just got home from work. Yeah, are you in Dreamlight Valley tonight? Hope work was well. Not in the inventory? Wait, what's not in the inventory? First game I ever got for the Switch and love it. Ooh. If you do a Sims 4 stream, I'll tell you guys my Sims profile so you can peep some of my builds. <gasps> Ooh, you know what? I need to fill up new crests. Maybe if you guys play The Sims um, and have builds, we can fill it up with you guys' builds. We can tour your builds. We can populate it with your Sims and your builds. Ooh, that would be so much fun. 
We could definitely do that. Teddy, you got 300 iron ingots? Oh. That's a record? That's got to be a record. Are you serious? How long did it take you to do that? Eddie, hey, you moved your home to the Sunlit Plateau? Oh, ranch vibe. I love that idea. The Sunlit Plateau is actually beautiful, and I love the water there. Maybe I'll move my house there, too. I tried to order that outdoor kitchen, but it won't let me. Yeah, because having one in each area would be perfect. Teddy, you can just pass those over to me. And while you're passing them over, let me get some, too. <laughs> Stacey, you work at Marshall's? I love Marshall's. I love it. Should I tell I got you? Now I'm stashing gold bars. Stacking up on the gold bars, eh? <laughs> we all trying to get like that. Embarrassingly long. <laughs> Took too long. But you know what? You're not going to have to worry about a thing with 300 gold ingots. I mean, not gold, but iron ingots. You, you are set up. Like, literally, you can get gold easier than you can get iron. Huh? Okay, this, I, the stove isn't there. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Utilities? That's not it. <gasps> Where the heck? Hold on, let's go to all. Okay, we got firewood. There it is. Oh, you know what? It's just because it's not under appliances for some reason. Is the item is the item limit 600 overall or 600 per biome? Y'all correct me if I'm wrong, but I think it's 600 overall. You put Minnie's house in the frost, frozen heights. It looks so nice there. Oh, I think it's like complimentary tones with the pink and the blue. I think that would look nice. Hoping they have a feature where you're able to gift items to other players. Yes, I really hope they add that in because that would be so cool to like if we could use our mail mailbox to do it. I work in a warehouse where over time to push holiday product to the store. 60 hour work weeks. Oh my goodness. Well, thank you for that hard work. That's a I mean, 60 hours is a lot of a lot of work time though. Okay, so let's place our new stove. I'm so excited. I've been I've been wanting this stove for a long time, y'all. For a long time. Where is it? There it is. Ah, beautiful. Isn't that just a lovely sight to see? And while we're at it, let's go ahead and put down our campfire wood. Honestly, not sure if you ever need raw iron. Seemed like I need a lot of iron for these quests. How many hours does everyone have in the game? Last time I checked, I think that was like two days ago. I had almost 80 hours. Y'all probably got me beat though. I have a lot of Disney uh, land recreation builds in The Sims 4. Ooh, I love that. I definitely need to see those. Yeah, it's 600 overall. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Claire! Hello, Claire! I literally am three hours late, but I made it. Just spent the last few hours repeatedly giving the same presentation about hidden disabilities to a group of scouts. Oh, that's such a wonderful thing to do. Educational everywhere. We love that. We love you, Claire. That's okay. I'm so glad that you made it, even if it is for the, the last ending part of the stream. But that's okay. We're just so happy to see you. We were talking about you earlier. We missed you. Steph, you're going to bed. Good night. Thank you for stopping in. Have a great night's sleep. Okay, so I'm going to move this chest, actually. Claire, we have so much to update you on. Oh, man. 200 hours, Kayla? That is some grinding. Yes, yeah, so we got... Um, we got lots of dresses. 
I like that little wood there, right? That's kind of cool. Like a little extra firewood. We got all, well, I want to say all. But look at this. We got Ariel's gown. And we got Elsa's gown now. I'm not going to lie, y'all. I think I might like Elsa's gown better than Ariel's gown. I don't know. Do I dare say that? We also are working on Minnie's quest. We got Donald Duck's fountain. We figured out where the stone goes in the cave. Hopefully these will be the same kids that protect and defend my kiddo in middle and high school. I really do hope that. We need more of that, honestly. Because kids can be so mean. I get homesick, but it makes me happy when my bills give other people that I'm Disney. Yeah, because you know that Disney feeling just makes you so happy. Also, Claire, for... <laughs> We also have transformed the coffee fund to a Wally tattoo fund because somehow we landed on the idea, and it's a great idea, that we're going to, I'm going to get a Wally tattoo because it's a great representation of my channel growth and all of you guys. So now I'm getting a Wally tattoo sometime within the coming months. December 6th will be the deadline. Anytime between now and December 6th, I shall have a Wally tattoo. <laughs> yes, we've been very busy this episode. We're trying to get all prepared for Scar. Elsa's gown is perfect with those wings. That's what I, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, this looks like perfect outfit. I dug a million holes. It's true. We got all the clay we needed, but now we need hardwood and iron. for the donation Claire Wally tattoo I'm in for that we are well on the way man that tattoo is happening sooner than you guys think I can't wait honestly it would I think that tattoo is gonna be so freaking cute yeah we're thinking right on the cheek you know <laughs> ain't that right Ronald I think on the lower ribs would be cute I was thinking there too I had two plots of pumpkins and was able to uh to Gray Moana Spell, Scrooge McDuck's store, restaurant, and all my house. Oh, so you upgraded all of them. Oh, you see, the pumpkins is the, that's, that's what I just did. The pumpkins is money. Ah! <laughs> Get that tattoo, girl. Thank you so much, Mika, for the donation. Y'all are make y'all don't understand. Y'all are making me so excited for this tattoo. Okay, so I'm going to put some stuff in the community tab so I can figure out like different art styles, like the one TJ was talking about. I like the behind the ear placement idea. I really like that too. And I wear my hair up a lot, so I think it would look really good there and I could always hide it if I wanted to. But I'd never want to hide that. Or ankle. Ankle's a good spot too. See what happens? We're all left unattended. <laughs> So it's all like behind the ear place. I mean, um, when we're missing Claire, we definitely get get into some trouble. Steph, that's hilarious. <laughs> I'll watch it while doing deliveries from the neighborhood committee tomorrow. Yay! Oh, thank you, Mo. <laughs> Good luck. Thank you for donating to the tattoo fund. <laughs> thank you so much for the donation. I appreciate y'all. Look at look at this. Oh no. <laughs> Wally Tat on the way. Let's go. <laughs> oh, it's definitely happening. I think we actually probably have enough money for a Wally tattoo right now. Should I get this next month? The Wally tattoo might be happening next month, people. Thank you for the donation, babe. <laughs> that's um, that's my husband right there, y'all. Mimi, thank you so much for the donation. Yes, tattoo bud. Y'all are going crazy right now. Come on. Okay, it's ha I'm telling y'all it's happening. I'm not joking. I'm so I'm being so serious when I say I'm getting Wally tattooed. Oh, yes, I am, as an update, I am going to be working on making that Discord, too. 
It's suddenly a hype train, right? <laughs> hey, Barzy. Thank you for the donation, Wally. Let's go. Oh, my God. It's going to be so good. Yes. Yes. That's my husband, Sean Cronin. <laughs> the $9, the $10 donation. I follow her IG, so I'll be watching that tattoo to be posted. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Y'all already know. I'm going to post it on the community tab, too. Or in the Discord. I'm going to be working on that Discord, so I should have that up by next week at the latest. Okay, I came. I don't. I forgot why I was at the crafting table for a second, y'all. I wanted to craft up another stack of this firewood. Mr. K, yes. Ooh, I love that. <laughs> Oh, Cranny, thank you so much. <gasps> Roland, there's an idea. You hear that, Sean? I'll get Wally and you get Eve. So when I saw your post about the update in Dreamlight Valley, I nearly screamed at work on my lunch. <laughs> no, I literally let out a scream. Y'all should have seen how fast I started. To, I started getting my fingers moving to post that so y'all could see. Katrina's husband in the chat, let's go, right, Barzi? <laughs> Y'all are funny. Do it, do it, do it. No, that's a different Sean. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. All right. He's tatted, okay? He could take a little Eve tattoo. That wouldn't be nothing for him. We don't have any for Sean to get a tattoo. Uh-oh. Sean? He got to agree to it first. We not wasting no donations on somebody who's not serious. You got to be serious. Mr. K. Not me calling him that around the house. Mr. K, can I borrow you for a second? <laughs> we do love a supportive husband. Yes, we do. Ooh, Sean is a handsome man. Thank you, Claire. Could you imagine? That would be like the per... We would be almost a power couple with those tattoos. I mean, what's there to talk about? Sean, you see that? Oh, it's, get, it's getting hot in the chat right now. It's getting hot in the chat right now. Mo says he'll donate $50 right now, Sean, if you agree to it, to an Eve tattoo. Farzy facts, Claire. He's so handsome. <laughs> Uh-oh. It's pumpkin watering time. Uh-oh. Sean, I know you can hear. I know you hear this. <laughs> He's regretting outing himself. <laughs> Try he tried to say it ain't him, y'all. Ronald, this is a great idea. Look what we started. <laughs> uh, okay, watch out. You got some competition for your hubby. At this point. <laughs> oh my God, this is amazing. I am having so much fun. <laughs> now, I know I didn't make this little garden in splat right here. Or spot, not splat spot this small Donald is just I just don't know I tried to calm him down but it's just not working Barzy will kill Katie's a handsome beast to keep up with their their kiddo is going to be gorgeous within 20 years hello he's gonna be a handsome little man oh Katrina make sure you record and take pictures of your experience you know what just because it's the Wally donation fund, I will vlog it and I will post a vlog on my YouTube channel. And that's how we'll celebrate together. What do you guys think about that? Good night, Deanna. Thank you so much for coming. As always, I love seeing you and thank you so much for hanging out. Banish Donald. <laughs> oh my gosh. 
I don't think nothing can come down, Donald. He, I don't think he can. I think he literally is just, he gets himself so worked up, he just can't help it. Okay, let's go back to the Glade of Trust to continue mining. I almost forgot what we was doing for a while. Okay, vlog it is. Vlog it. it I will vlog the Wally tattoo. Good, bad, rain, or sunshine. Wally tattoo is happening. And I will vlog it. That's how we'll celebrate. It'll be perfect. So you guys can literally see. See the process start to finish. I'm actually so excited about this. I'm about to be up. Literally, I try to go to bed after the streams because I'm like, okay, let me get some sleep. And now I'm about to be up all night looking at different art styles for this Wally tattoo. Make Donald and Mother Gothel live together. <laughs> oh, you know what would be perfect because Mother Gothel would just be miserable. Did I miss it? Sean say there's an Eve tattoo in his future. He he literally is gone radio silent. He went radio silent. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Ketos, welcome to the channel. I love your energy and good vibes. Thank you so much for joining and being a part of the community. Welcome to the family. So happy to see you on the stream. And thank you so much. Oh, Chantel, thank you so much for the donation. We are literally, we probably are right where we need to be at. For It's been so long since I got a tattoo. I wonder how much one is going to cost. It won't cost, I think it's going to be something small, like dainty and cute. So it probably won't cost more than a hundred bucks. I think the one I have on my ankle is like, was a hundred and that one has like really colorful and takes up majority of the space on my ankle so now i just got to find the perfect tattoo artist and the perfect art style i'm so excited Ooh, that was a lot of um iron that's a beautiful thing gotha would be so miserable oh my gosh could you imagine if he was stuck in the house with her <laughs> look at ursula all the way out there in the middle of the ocean what is she doing He's lurking now. He went right back into lurk mode. <laughs> what? You can't tell me he's in the strong silent type. No, no, no. Actually, you know what? Sean is a little bit more introverted than I am. I wouldn't describe him as an introvert, but he is definitely more on the calm side, and I am on the crazy side. <laughs> but that's why we work, because it's like yin and yang. How do we get the wrench uh, next to your name? Oh, that's, Claire is a, um, she moderates the stream. <laughs> Mo said, I want a wrench. <laughs> you need that, Mo? Okay. There you go, Mo. <laughs> I don't think it's a door prize. <laughs> it's funny. Mo's actually a friend of ours. So there you go. Hey, introverts in the house. Come on. All the introverts stand up. All right, let's go back to the forest of valor now. Because we almost have what we need. You're a Sagittarius, right? Right. What is Sean's sign? Um, uh, is it, I think it's Libra. No, it's Virgo. He's a Virgo, right? <laughs> He's definitely a Virgo, I think. I always get Libra and Virgo mixed up and I don't know why. Let me see. Yeah, Libra. I was, I, my first one was right. <laughs> I always get it messed up. He's a Libra. Not me getting startled when Ursula just popped up next to me. <laughs> Hello, angel fish. Sean's Katrina's wonderful husband. He's just shy. He's overwhelmed, guys. He's overwhelmed. <laughs> That's why I get Virgo mixed up because it's so close. Yeah, he's Libra. He's in September. 
Tracy! You're Aquarius? When I get the update... When the updates come, I'll let you know if I can get uh, past the Elsa quest. I hope so. I hope with the update, they fix some of the issues you guys have been experiencing. That would be really nice. I want to be an introvert, but I'm, I have a big mouth. <laughs> oh my gosh. I can't help it. I just like, when you're extroverted, you're just extroverted. It just is what it is. You either love me or you hate me. That's what it comes down to, honestly. Guys, y'all don't know. I am so excited about this tattoo. Oh, your mom's a Libra too? Nice. Libras are awesome. Hey, Libra gang. Bars, you part of the Libra gang too. Look at you. Stacy, you're a Cancer. Mo's a Leo. Okay. Mo, what are y'all playing tonight? Are y'all playing? Probably Fall Guys, huh? I know, it has been a Zodiac chat tonight. Oh yeah, y'all are in Fall Guys. Paige, we've got another Cancer in the chat. I'm an introvert, but I talk way too much. One of my friends think I talk too much. Hey, hey, hey. I don't think I like that. You talk just enough. Wrench gang. <laughs> Sean sucks, so we stopped playing. <laughs> oh my gosh. All right, how much more hardwood do I need? Oh my lord, y'all. We ain't never gonna get this hardwood. Where else is there hardwood? Is there hardwood in um the Sunlit Plateau? Mo's lucky he got the wrench. <laughs> I'm playing Dreamlight Valley. My character is wearing my Buzz Lightyear jacket. Ooh, I haven't seen the blood Buzz Lightyear jacket. Too much rip hardwood. I'm about to start. We can't chop down trees. <laughs> Okay, there's a piece. Yeah, there's definitely some here. So let's try to collect up what else is out here. Oh, try the Frozen Heights? Okay. Sean does play games. He likes um, COD, so Call of Duty, and he likes uh, Fall Guys. Those are only two he plays, though. He's oh, Actually, he's also played... What's that one called? Um, the space one. Uh, 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 uh. Why am I drawing a blank on that one? There's another one that he plays. He likes like the shooter games. But he also, he really likes Fall Guys. He's actually really good at Fall Guys too. Uh oh, they about to get me though. <laughs> Not Dead Space. Um, It's the one, they just came out with a new one. Um, How do I describe it? Halo. Yes, Halo. That's the one. Oh my gosh. I don't know why my brain is like this, y'all. I just don't. Oh, yes, there is some hardwood here. Thank you, thank you. Greetings, Katrina, but is he is he good? I, I mean, is he better than y'all? I don't know that I can say that, Mo. I don't know, because he won't agree to his Eve tattoo, so it's just starting to seem like a big IDK. Is he good at all? IDK. Delete all your trees until you only got three trees in the Glade, Forest, Frozen Heights, and Forgotten Lands, okay? Will that give me more? I think, yeah, y'all did say that it'll give you more, or it's easier to collect the wood. The only problem is I really like the trees in some of these areas. It's so like a part of me wants to keep them, even though it's making it harder on myself. Okay, mostly forests and the Forgotten Heights, okay. There's definitely a lot of hardwood here. Yeah, okay, that's what it is. It's easier to find what you need. Yeah. Because this is definitely taking a minute. With how many folks get trees, they should make them choppable. I know. It would be even cool if they made them choppable and then they just kind of regrow. Or maybe, like, if you get tree seeds, you could replant or something. That would be a cool idea. You're right. My inventory is packed. Okay. Thanks, Grace. We're going back to the house. We're going to clear out the inventory now. 
trying to put them on. I'm just saying, you know. I'm just saying. I bet you could get Sean, uh, get Sean and console <laughs> to a Halo match. She's bomb at Halo. Look, he, I don't know if he's any good, but he definitely he played it for a little while. He just didn't stick to it. Thank you. You're so sweet and very kind. My friends don't talk to me much and kind of makes me feel down a lot. Makes my depression worse, but I love hearing happy people. It makes my heart happy. Listen, you can always come here and talk as much as you want. Don't let anybody tell you that you don't that you shouldn't talk or talk less. Friends or not, I don't like that. Okay, you are who you are, and they can accept that or they they don't accept that. Either way, because trust me, there are people out there who will accept you exactly as you are. And that's from Mama K. Don't nobody be messing with y'all. Okay? Because I'm going to get real defensive over y'all. All right? Ooh, we got 35 iron. That's not bad. I tried Call of Duty and didn't understand. I can't play shooter games. I'm literally so bad at sh <laughs> shooting games. It's bad. Okay, we're going to keep that shiny emerald. Because we can gift those. We'll put those into the inventory. Let's drop off our dream shards. This game is one thing that you need to hoard things ahead for sure. Yeah, no, it's actually good to... People were originally like, don't hold on to stuff. But I actually think it's more ben beneficial to hold on to stuff. <laughs> or I thought today was already Saturday. I know, I get my days mixed up so bad. Thank you, beautiful angel. Of course, I really mean that, seriously. I lied. I thought Rusty was already... Oh, yes, yes. Oh, yeah, and I don't know... Claire, I don't know if you were in the stream when I said, but I, I'm thinking about possibly doing a pop-up stream on Sunday if my husband's not working. I remember being told in fourth grade that I talk too much, and ever since then I catch myself, I get too chatty. Nope. We like chatty. People told me the same thing. Some people think I'm too obnoxious or too energetic. Like, I could be too much. It's like, okay, well, I'm just not your cup of tea then, baby. <laughs> One thing about me, you don't have to like me. We don't have to hang out. <laughs> it's that simple. Just don't come around me. Okay, so we can make seven iron igots. I'd rather have a few friends that actually like me for who I am than a bunch of friends who don't like me behind my back. ta Now, okay, I'm about the environment vibe. I keep my trees. I also keep the crops in each biome, and I don't have a mega farm. All my trees and bushes stayed in each biome next to their gardens. Yeah, I think that's what I'm going to end up doing. I really, like, I would actually, it, I know it would be beneficial if I organized everything, like, so that it was easier for the, me to collect wood and stuff, but I really like the tree. The only place that I can't really stand is the Forgotten Lands. Like, there are way too many trees out there, so I'm going to have to remove a lot of those. I'm carrying YouTube right now. Come on. Tomorrow's Red Fox, 2 a.m. to 8 a.m. Pink Croc at 6 a.m. to noon. Oh, I gotta. I haven't even fed one Pink Croc yet, so I've got. I'm gonna have to get on early. Yes, that's the attitude. That's the 2022-2023 attitude, okay? Look, uh-oh, Donald's stuck. <laughs> that man said, not this rock again. Oh, not me money bins. <laughs> oh, no, not me money bins. I finished all the quests, and all are level 10, and my purse is maxed out. Now I'm farming and grinding materials for the update and making money. You're in the perfect spot. You are literally in the perfect spot. You are prepared for that scar up today. That's for sure. That red fox window is short. They said you're going to have to catch him. <laughs> you too, uh, TJ? That's right. I really should be going to sleep. I'm going to the theater tomorrow. I'm seeing touring company off Broadway. <gasps> Ooh, that sounds like so much fun, Lisa. You're gonna. I know you're going to enjoy that. Oh, it's Ursula. Oh, my God. Girl, I thought you was an octopus floating on the top of the water. <laughs> oh, wait, you are. <laughs> oh, my.
better not hoard your interview like how your inventory like Wally does. You know, I wish I had like a little compartment that just like it's like a little box that opens up like Wally's. That's too cute. I ran out of space for fish today and had to spend a lifetime cooking fish dishes. Oh, you know how long cooking takes me. We don't have that mass cooking option too. Really, I think like the Glade might be one of the best places for um, iron. I always get a ton of iron from here. Oop, yes. Some more hardwood. It looks like it's respawned, so let's pick this up. I just got my black squirrel companion, named him Shadow. Ooh, I love that name. Shadow. Oh my gosh, I just emptied my inventory. It's because we have all of these hundreds of materials. Ooh, two hardwood right here. Nice. How do y'all know the times? Is there somewhere you can look them up? Claire got all the info. And yes, you can look it up if you're if you're wondering what time they spawn and stuff. Plus, you can always check your collections menu to see what's there for the day. So if you come here and go to critters and you go over them, you can see who's here and when. But it doesn't help if you are trying to specifically catch one. You need to know exactly when to look. Saturday here for me, I was up till three just to feed the red fox and that's the last fox I need to become. Did you get it, Paige? Oh, Paige, by the way, welcome back. Did you get her or do you have to feed him again? Let's go back up to the Forest of Valor. We are grinding right now, y'all. This is like the real grind. <laughs> Grace, you told me not to hoard. I'm trying my best not to hoard. Ooh, Claire, you got the orchard bird today. I literally have fed the orchard birds like three, four times and nothing. Not a... Not a damn thing, literally. <laughs> Literally. I was literally told by a friend they didn't like me because I was always cracking jokes the other day. Yep, okay. Well, um, I'm good. <laughs> Sounds boring to me. <laughs> I think I'll pass. Like, you don't like jokes? That's weird. <laughs> Are you okay? <laughs> yes, you can catch the animals. So you can collect them as companions. So you have to feed the animals. We don't really know at this point if you have to feed them a certain amount of times. Like for the squirrels, I know you only need to feed the squirrels twice. They should become companions. But they all like specific food items. So, but yes, you can feed them, and then once you feed them, you can come into your inventory, go to wardrobe, and you can see Pooh is my companion back there, but, like, these are all the companions I've collected so far. <gasps> I got the blue clocker down now! Oh, it's so cute! Uh, I didn't even realize I got the blue crocodile. But yeah, then they can follow you around. I don't like the birds. I want a raven, though. The ravens actually look really cool, and you know what the ravens is going to look good with? That Ursula dress. The Raven's gonna look real good with that Ursula dress. I like grains where I have to grind too. I think it adds a level of, like, it compli complicates the game in a good way. Like, it does, it's just not easy. You can't just fly through. Like, you actually have to, like, this game has done a really good job of making it to where you have to be on at certain times. Um, you're not gonna get a bunch, you can't just spam a bunch of things most of the time. Like, you actually have to grind it out to get stuff. I downloaded an app that has all the recipes on it. Somebody made a Disney Dreamlight Valley app, Jessica? Are we are, are we serious? Because I need to see this. They should fix storage. Why all those slots if we can't use them? Exactly. That is correct. Oh, you know what? I have not been using my inventory the way that I told you guys I was. Hello. I don't know why I didn't just do this. Put my storage chest down. And then I can just throw everything over here. So that can go, coal can go, uh, emerald can go, shiny emerald can stay. That flower can go, apples can go. What else? We can put our pumpkin seeds in here for right now. Cool. Yep, all this stuff can go. Yeah, 
Now we've cleared out our inventory space. Look at that. I love that little hack. That is a, if you guys haven't seen my storage hack video, um, I explain uh, all of the storage hacks that I like in the game right now. And that is one of my favorites because it literally acts like a, a backpack. TJ, you're the best. And I, I mean that quite literally. You are the best. Yeah, don't let nobody tell y'all in here that y'all are less than or not fun to be around or whatever. You just find new friends. It's that simple. Again, we're not, we not going for that. <laughs> not at all. All right, let's see if there's some more. You know what I love? I love the little noise that the foxes make when they're running around. Yes, thank you so much for the, uh, the link to that again, Claire. Thank you, thank you. Critter success is controlled by RNG, so squirrels are easier than... Oh, that's right. Not clear enough. <laughs> it's not good enough. I'm trying. I don't know why clearing stuff out and getting rid of things is so difficult for me. Like, I literally... I'll just have, like, one single carrot in my inventory that I could just sell, and just for some reason, I just can't. <laughs> Oh my gosh, a cat companion would be so good. Somebody said, what if we got, like, um, Simba, like, baby Simba as a companion? I hope we get another uh, chest in the game with more slots. Maybe they can balance it by making it more resource intensive. Yeah, like, even if they did, like, a quest, like, I think Scrooge's, you know that, that, um, um, what is it called? The safe that you get from Scrooge. I think that we should be able to get, we should have got more storage with that. So even if they just updated some of the chests with more storage, that would be good. The unofficial Disney Dreamlight Valley companion guide. Oh, I gotta check that out. That's actually really exciting. All right, let's go back to the Sunlit Plateau because I think we definitely, can, we can move the well too to get to the other side. I have all the raccoons apart from one. I figured them out, but I can't figure out the Crocs cues. So the Crocs page are just like the um, like the foxes and the rabbits. Oh, no, no, I'm sorry. The foxes are just, no. What is it? The raccoons. The Crocs. The Crocs are just like raccoons. You play the same game with them. And you feed them lobster. That's their favorite. Oh, there's some wood back there. That took me a minute to get out. <laughs> The croc, the crocs, the raccoon, the birds, the the raccoon bird, the you know the, yep, <laughs> like what? What are you trying to say right now? <laughs> Baby Simba would be my companion for life. Oh, absolutely, absolutely. Okay, let's move the well to the other side. Perfect. And now we can fast travel and get all the wood that's on the other side. That'll be just wonderful. Oh, I forgot to water my pumpkins in the Forgotten Lands. Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, look at this. Look at this. I'll take that. Thank you so much. See, I just been feeding the sunbirds, whatever. Where's the sunbird at? I wonder if the crows are going to play like a, a certain type of game. Claire said your hoarding is as bad as Wally and Arable <laughs> Ariel combined. <laughs> Honestly, it's probably worse at this point. There's a rumor going around that storage will be improved with this update. <gasps> Could you guys imagine? What if the, the storage is improved so well that we don't need our storage rooms anymore? <laughs> I'm still very hopeful for that, though. Absolutely. Yeah, even if it's not this update, I'd just be happy to know one is eventually coming. Because my storage room, I really actually kind of like the storage room. I think it's a cool idea for one of the rooms because you can buy so many different rooms. So let's see the lobster roll. Because we fancy. Ooh, ooh, look at that. That lobster roll brought the energy all the way up. Not this map glitch. Can we not?
the foxes are harder than the crocs so mimi the foxes should be easier i think all you need to do is run up to them and when they run away you just chase them they should be easier than the crocs was this the bird i just fed yeah Ooh, clay i'll take that thanks so much Guys, I forget to drink my water when I'm streaming. Y'all don't forget to drink your water. Don't forget to drink your water. Water is needed for hydration. I want a black cat. I feel like cat, like what if they added cats and dogs? That would be so good. The crows are probably gonna be hard since it's the scariest biome. What do you think about the rumors? that we are about to be turned evil. <gasps> Could you imagine? Wouldn't that be fun though? Like that would be a real interesting twist. Now here's my question. Is this cave the one that was in the back? Cause it didn't look like it, right? Like the cave looked like it was over here for some reason to me. Like it was on this side or something? Like where are they gonna put that cave at? I am curious. Hope they fix the max, map glitching. Yeah, yeah, that's a that's real annoying. That's the only consistent glitch I've really had on PC. Let me put this right back where it goes. Yep, perfect. Yes, dogs would be so cute. Dogs would be so cute. TJ, you just bought 400 more pumpkins? Oh, you're not playing around tonight. You are not playing around, not at all, not even a little bit. Oh girl, Mama G is going to call you playing again. <laughs> no, really, she's gonna be so upset. You ate my lobster roll? Absolutely, I did. And I don't regret it. Oh, look at that, Remy's awake. I agree, does it look the same in the teaser pic? Yeah, I know, so is it like gonna be a new cave added? What is happening? I have so many questions. Alrighty, wonderful people, I'm heading to bed. Thanks for the stream, Kay, have a good night. Oh, thank you for stopping in, Steph. I appreciate you for coming by, and thank you for the donation and all of your light and energy on the stream. Love to see you, and love hanging out with you. Hope you have a good night. Thanks for the hydration reminder. I also reminded me to take my meds, nice. All right, we're going to have to add a hydration reminder in on these streams because I get off these streams and I'm like, ah, dehydrated. Oh, ho, ho. Trace, you drink two gallons of water every day? Good Lord. That's fantastic for your body. Could you imagine, like, if they weren't just, like, cats and dogs, but, like, kittens and puppies? <gasps> oh, my gosh, that would be so good. Why couldn't that, ha why couldn't that have been iron? Like, I don't want to complain, but why couldn't that have been iron? We're almost to a hundred hardwood, y'all. I can't get off stream until I get all I get all the pieces to this to this puzzle. That's just where I'm at with it right now, you know. <laughs> hey, hey, you, yeah, you. Did you click the like button yet? Hop to chop chop. Please and thank you, my friends. For those of you who always that's already given the stream a thumbs up, thank you so much. I really appreciate you guys. It really does support the channel, and it helps us find new new friends for the stream. But yes, if you haven't already, make sure you hit that like button. I would greatly appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. I don't think any hard wood spawned back here, but we definitely have iron. I'm hoping one day we'll get Bambi characters. Oh my God, listen, just add, I don't even need quests for Bambi. Just add Bambi in and let her roam the beautiful valley. I'd be happy with that. <laughs> Literally, I'd be happy with that. I'd spend my life on the potty if I drank two gallons a day. I know. Honestly, it's probably good that I'm not like drinking a ton of water because I would legit have to like, be right back like I gotta go use the bathroom real quick <laughs> oh look at that that was a ton of iron 
Now we just need a little bit more hard wood. Oh, there's some. Thank you. Is that hardwood? I think that's regular wood. Oh yes, the hardwood respawn, nice. Take a break from the mining. I feel like Wally wants to hang out with you. <gasps> Where's Wally? Where is my friend Wally? Did we run past him? We really haven't talked to him at all today. Next time I see him, I'm gonna have a little chat. Maybe give him a gift. Not my buddy. Not my buddy. Pick up all the woods you see there so the mixed trees force... Oh, okay, okay. So make sure we pick up all the wood. Okay. We're going to force you guys to spawn us some more wood. <laughs> Tell me why Bambi was... A Wait. Bambi was a boy? Huh? No, no, no. <laughs> Wait a minute. Ooh, Stacey, you're off all weekend? That's a lot of time for Disney Dreamlight Valley. Any plans for the weekend? I thought Bambi was a girl. And I'm kind of shocked by this, so... I'm gonna need a second to recuperate. <laughs> like, huh? Huh? Do you think they'll add more biomes or only realms? Um, I think that we'll probably get realms before biomes. But I do think that they'll probably add more biomes. I mean, if I was them, I would add more biomes for sure. All right, picking up all of the sticks so we force spawn. Okay, but Thumper and Flower and the Skunk as companions. <gasps> oh, that would be so good. Thumper, oh my gosh. Okay, come on. Run away. I'll chase you. I'll chase you. While I'm chasing you, though, I'm going to pick up this wood. But we can continue to play. <laughs> Watch out, Scrooge. We're chasing a fox. Can't you see? The foxes are so cute. Here's some salmon for you, my friend. I hope for more biomes. I wonder about a mountain one. Ooh. I really do think they'll come out with more biomes. I really do. Ooh, that was a Lion King one. Okay, ooh, some more over here, nice. I keep thinking about how the woods from Winnie the Pooh would be such a great new biome. Ooh, yes, that would be beautiful actually. Oh my gosh, not these jewels just sitting out here. Bambi was a little buck, oh my gosh. Wait, like, I think that, like, I was just a kid, and for some reason as a kid, I just assumed that Bambi was a boy. I mean, a girl. I don't know, I don't know why I thought that. Like, now that I think about it, I'm like, why did I assume that? <laughs> wow. Wow, wow, wow. Uncultured, I am. Well, you learn something new every day, huh? It would be amazing if they had a royal ball in the castle and all the characters come. That's a great idea. I saw somebody who actually posted um, a picture of like, they made like a long table with like all the food on it. And I really want to do that in the game. I think that would be a cute idea. Not a piece of wood hiding back here. We're so close. We need 11 more pieces of hardwood. I think we can do it, guys. I think we can do it. Let's go back to the house and craft up. See how much more iron we need. There's so much to do in this game. I hope they um, take note from the community. I really, and I think the community has such great ideas too. So like, I feel like it's just like, it's the perfect opportunity to take ideas from the community, to be honest. We're not even close with the iron. <laughs> We need 15 more iron. Is this a joke? Okay, we just did the forest. Let's go back to the glade. I have a friend I play golf for an hour on PlayStation. The rest will be Dreamlight Valley. Nice. 
Sounds like the perfect day. Claire, that makes sense that you can't, um, that you need to pick up all the wood for it to, you know, respawn. I don't know why I didn't think about that. There's so many great movies and so many doors to castle to this game. I know, like, seeing all those up, oh, Donald's stuck again. Seeing all those doors that are, like, coming, oh my gosh. This just means that we have so much more time to play in this game together. I think that's what's most exciting. That means, like, all new outfits, all new friendships, all new quests, like, all new critters, possible biomes. We definitely know new realms are coming. So, I mean, there's just really so much value to this game. I think the Star Path will have Halloween items. Ooh, wouldn't that be cool? Wouldn't that be so cool? Thank you for that extra piece of iron. I really needed that. Oh, we got 90. I gotta go to bed, but thanks for such a fun stream night, you guys. Thank you so much for coming, Libby. It was so awesome to hang out with you. I hope you have a great night. Get some sleep. Notice in the teaser, Wally's holding up a pumpkin. Hint at Halloween, I assume. Definitely a hint at Halloween. I was also wondering, because the crows are, like, right above him, like, is the crow's favorite food gonna be pumpkins? Oh, you are... Look, I have a new name to add to the band list for this channel. This is just crazy. YouTube has got to do better with that stuff. Thank you so much, Claire. It's my latest favorite game. I still play Animal Crossing once a day and do my dailies and the rest I spend in Dreamlight Valley. Yeah, I'm not going to lie. I have to say, and this is, again, it's no shade, but I am definitely more of a Dreamlight Valley girl than Animal Crossing. Uh, it was a bot, but Claire got them super fast, so they didn't really stand a chance. <laughs> They didn't really stand a chance at all. She said, oh, word, check this out. <laughs> she said, watch this. <laughs> Y'all remember the Usher meme? Watch this. Mm -mm -mm. They're ravens, not crows. Oops. Okay, I'm sorry. The ravens. Ravens actually sounds much better than crows anyway. All right, I think some hardwood respond. 92. Is there any more on this side? I feel like at some point they'll have to have new lands because of all the characters in the houses. Yeah, I like, and actually that's a really good point, Mimi, because it's like, where would they put everybody? Where would they put everybody? I feel like they're gonna have to. They're not, they really don't have a choice. You're so right about that. I'm just tired of hearing it compared to Animal Crossing because it's so different and it's setting people up for false expectations. Yeah, for sure. I think it's like a marketing plot too. Like if you, it's a way to draw people in. Like if you like Animal Crossing, but they're definitely very different games. But I think it has some similar aspects, and that's what people are playing off of. Oh Lord, not again! <laughs> oh, that's dark wood. We need hardwood. Oh, don't let me forget. While we're over here, we really need to uh, water our pumpkins. Who the hell is that? Is that Scrooge humming? Why did he just start humming out of nowhere? Okay, there's literally no hardwood up here. I <laughs> laugh my ass off. Bye, bot. So long. Not my pumpkins being totally neglected up here. I think we might go through a tunnel to a new map then Disney Dreamlight combined biomes get too much. 
Ooh, could you imagine going through like a portal or a tunnel to a new map? Two of my favorite movies, Red Riding Hood, Pride and Prejudice, and Zombies Perfect to watch for Halloween. I can't watch anything scary. These are more romance. Ooh, I like a good romance too. Because I'm a crybaby and I always cry on romance. <laughs> I don't know what it is with my loaded inventory. Look at this random piece of corn. Get out of here. Oh gosh, I can't even pick it up because I'm full. All right, it's okay, I have a plan, people. Don't stress and don't fret. I have my magic <laughs> storage box. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Oh boy, okay. Well, onions, uh, all these gems are gonna go. Ah, uh, like the screaming in the background is actually insane. <laughs> okay, that can go. Uh huh. Cherries. I think we need the rocks. Yeah, that can go. Okay, wonderful. Scrooge Hummy was creeped out, sounded like a fly stuck in some soup. <laughs> No, but really though, I'm like, what the hell is that? I forgot he was even behind us. I'm not even gonna lie. I forgot the man was behind us. All right, so let's go back maybe to the Forest of Valor. I might be getting back to the Forest of Valor too quick. Never tell me to look down. <laughs> I want to watch a scary movie real bad now, y'all. These, um... The rocks respawn real quick. I didn't need a jewel, Scrooge, but fine. Alright, we just need... What, six more wood? Some more iron. <gasps> yes. Okay, let's pick all this up. Greetings, neighbor. No, I don't want to talk to you, Good sir. Christy. Hi, I'm here. What did I just miss? Okay, so we've had a very eventful stream today. But we have gotten all of the... Well, not all of, but we got a lot of dresses today. So we got Ariel's seafoam gown. We got um, Elsa's gown here. We also got Ariel Seafoam Suit. So they're both at level 10, so we're really happy about that. Um, we're working on finishing up Minnie's Quest. We've built Donald Duck's Fountain. Sell all the jewels. You're low on cash. I am low on cash. Okay, we can sell all the jewels. I do need to do that. I keep the shinies as gifts sometimes, but I'd rather sell them because I think most of our friendships or relationships are up high enough. What the hell is that? That hard wood. You know what? I don't have any more stumps. I just realized that. I removed all the stumps today. Pick this stuff up. I heard it was every five minutes. Okay, that's not too bad. Ooh, a stump. Speaking of the devil. None of that was hard wood. Is that what we're doing right now? Really? 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 Okay, where haven't we been for a minute? We are there, we are just there. Let's go back to the Glade of Trust. <laughs> We've been back and forth to the Glade of Trust. I don't know how many times today. I'm like, why am I running slow? She's low on energy. Frosted Heights, should we go back to the Frosted Heights? We may not get enough iron this stream, but we're definitely gonna finish up the wood. Yeah, you know what? I I honestly, with as good as the game is, I would not be mad if it wasn't free to play. Like, it's cool that they're trying to do it, but I'm, I'm hoping that when it is free to play that it doesn't lose, like, its spark, you know? I don't know that it will or if that would even make sense, but I just hope that it just continues to get better and better. 
Oh yeah, Christy, that's right. That's the, that's the major. <laughs> I forgot to mention the most important thing. I'm getting a Wally tattoo. The coffee fund was transformed to a Wally tattoo fund, and sometime between this month, this next month, and my birthday, I will getting be getting a cute little Wally tattoo, and I can't wait because I'm I'm literally so excited. I cannot wait. I've been dying for another tattoo, and it's gonna be the perfect tattoo. So real excited about that. Oh, what's that? Okay, there's some wood here, but it's not what I need. I constantly type uh, frosted flakes instead of frosted heights. Honestly, I think it's a it's a great replacement name. Honestly, we can just go with that. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I'm so hungry right now. You know, it sounds good. Some ramen noodles. Ooh, y'all. Yeah. Or some Takis. Does anybody eat Takis in the chat? Okay, let's go to the Frosted Heights. Just, I'm just gonna rename all the biome cereal names. <laughs> oh my gosh, why do I want to say that the um, Sunlit Plateau is like Captain Crunch? Hoard like you've never hoarded before the frosted flakes. <laughs> okay, we've got 97. We only need a little bit more. That's it. Mm-hmm. Some ramen sounds so good. Ooh, 98. Uh-oh. Not this random piece of mint back here. I'll take that. I can't believe how productive we've been this stream. I stopped eating them because my stomach would hurt in the morning. Ooh, that's probably, yeah, that's your body's way of saying, yeah, let's not do this anymore. <laughs> Good on you to listen to your body. If there's no hardwood here, I'm sorry in advance. There was, there was like three pieces of hardwood, so you were spot on. We're gonna go to the Sunlit Plateau next. Takis are so good, I love spicy. Spicy is like my favorite. Is my favorite, so I love Takis. And honestly, I'm not gonna lie, but the TikTok, the TikTok trend where they were sticking Takis in a jalapeno with cream cheese is actually delicious. I'm sorry, but it is, it's so good. Ugh, don't talk about food if I eat now. I'm going to be up and down all night to pee. Two babies sitting on the bladder ruins a girl. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> yeah, you know, it just, it's never the same after the babies. Ruby Raven, welcome in. I can't believe I caught your stream today. I'm so glad that you made it. Thank you for joining. How was your day today? Not me just ignoring all the plants that need to be harvested. <gasps> we're gonna get it guys we have enough hardwood now oh my gosh we have enough hardwood now we did it we did it pat yourselves on the back we did it I'm so happy about it. I did not think honestly the clock tower is so cute it's worth it it better be I know it better be because boy was this some work I was going to say, Minnie's just in the house sleeping away, but it's actually just Mickey. <laughs> Mine rebels at chocolate chip cookies. Oh, my goodness. Mmm. Chocolate chip cookie sounds like a hot chocolate chip cookie. Oh, my, oh, my. Oh, my gosh. We're so close to the iron. All right. Well, guys, I think I'm going to go ahead and leave the stream off here because it is almost 1 a.m. I'm going to be so tired, but I really, I don't even want to stop right now. I'm not even going to lie. I could just continue to play and grind it out. But like I said, guys, keep an eye on the community tab because I'm going to update you guys and let you know. If Sean's not working, then I will do a um, 
probably a pop-up stream on Sunday. So if you guys are interested, we will play again on Sunday. And Ruby, my day has been so good. I'm sorry you only caught the end of the stream, but I'm hoping you can catch another one. Dan, you just baked a pizza? I want. Send me a slice. <laughs> I will do your check house when the, your uh, chest hack when the update comes. Perfect. We're going to need it because we're going to have a bunch of new stuff to store. Yes, we have time before Scar. Thank you guys so much for coming to the stream. Thank you, Claire. I will get some good rest. You too. Jazz, bye. See you on the next one. Good night. Night, night, Cranny. This stream has been so great. Thanks. Hey, of course, TJ. It's, I've, it's been so amazing hanging out with you. Thank you so much for coming, as always. Oh, and before you guys go, don't forget to hit that thumbs up button on your way out. Thank you guys so much. Yay, hubby on a guy's trip. I've got nothing but time. Listen, I'm about to go up there and get on him. Like, so you getting this tattoo or what? <laughs> Good night, Jamie. Night, you guys. Good night, Stacy. Night, 80. Mad Max, I'm so glad you enjoyed. It was so good to see you. Tracy, good night, everyone. Had a wonderful time with you all. Yes, we had so much fun together. Good night, guys. And don't forget, I will be updating you guys on the community tab. And I'll also let you know when the Discord is ready so we can all hang out. Bye, guys. Have a good night. Get some good sleep or enjoy your day. And I will catch you all on the next stream. Peace.